Ladies and gentlemen, I know the grand final, and you know the surprise? It's Viper versus Hera, right? Okay. Viper versus Hera. Game number one, if you're watching on YouTube, thumb up, subscribe, leave a commentary, because it's, this is going to be amazing. All right, let's go. The Viper has a yellow Malians, Hera Saracens. African Red Beats. This map is brutality. It's fantastic. I love it, this map. And this generation is starting to be a Viper map. Look at this generation. You make here poly I mean, you can fist boom if you want. Yeah. The wood is already walled till the edge here. Yeah. He has berries, stone, gold, everything at the everything at the back. You know? I mean, seriously. Can't be better map here? No. It cannot be better map. Hera. His map, berries at the back, gold and stone at the back, is not a bad map either. But obviously I prefer the Viper because the wood is just everything at the back and, 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 and bigger, you know? Yeah, he got one, two, three, four, five wood lines. Hera has wood lines too? Yes, but a little bit farther from the TC. So I prefer the Viper map, you know? Yeah. Okay, let's see what it's going to be. Then about the sieves. Well, you have seen in the previous, in the semi-final, how Hera has used the Saracens in an aggressive way, you know? And that's pretty sick. Pretty, pretty sick. Okay. What? Rasnak! A underscore Ratsnak has just donated 20 euros and 23 cents. Viper Puff cast was okay, but Membrillo cast will be epic. Thanks for awesome 2023 fantastic and fanatic caster. Hope we get much more amazing timings and momentums in 2024. We'll try, we'll try, but I don't think so. The Viper cast it. I think the Viper played. That's why it's different. The POV is something. The casting is something else. But thank you for the support. Let's go. Okay, now this is the second Rhino. And he's gonna push the Zebras, right? Both are pushing the same? I believe so. Yeah. Yeah, they are They are just pushing the economy. He's not going to push the Zebras. I don't know how good is that the Viper and Hera face when NAC5 is gonna start in exactly one week. The next Saturday is a start NAC5, remember? By the way, for your information, I'm not gonna be in the first day. Because I will travel just that Saturday. I also a little bit of stress because the airports in Spain are gonna be in a strike. So good luck to me, you know. Good luck to me getting the plane in those moments. And hopefully I will be I will arrive to be ready for the second day. Yeah. Yeah. They sent me emails yesterday, so they say that my planes are covered, but I have one hour time because I have to take a plane to Madrid and then one to Madrid to Berlin. But if there is some delay in my first plane, I have one hour frame, time frame difference. Seems it's supposed to arrive in Madrid and take the second plane. So I don't know. Hopefully, but I'm not going to uh, be available for the first day because uh, I travel that day because it's a very important day here in Spain with the Three Kings. I don't know if you know that party or that special event that is mostly for my kids, you know? Anyway, that will be the next week. Now we need to focus. I was talking about that because it's important that Viper and Hera face in a final if another event with the same settings before the NAC 5. It can be important, but I don't think it's crucial. Why? Because also the NAC 5 has uh, like kind of a Swiss stage or group stage that they can face during the group stage. So, it's okay, you know, it's really okay. And we all know that when these players are facing, anything can really happen, you know? Obviously, it's important who is winning. It is, for the morale, also for the gameplay, for see the, if they can still, well, Hera winning like he's been winning lately, or for the Viper to see if he can win also. Ooh. To see if he can win the, the Canadian. HP both with 20. Oh, man. Oh, man. Yeah, a very good training match, for sure. Heal advantage, and... 
He's going now to the... Ooh, oh, my lord. Okay, Viper, take the scout. First mini battle won by the snake. Now Viper is willing on the left. Yeah, against all the players, he's not willing. He's not willing. Well, he walls, but now he's willing a little bit quicker. Eh, it's okay. He's doing the houses. Oh, wow. This will never be housed in this game anymore. And both are going for the scouts. It's super popular now. Scout seems to be the trend. This is scout now. Look how annoying it is. 3 HP, but he can take the fish. Yeah. He's gonna send a spear. He's sending. You don't want to lose it. I think he's gonna try to block it with this with the other. No. Nah, he's gonna save it. He's gonna save it. It is gonna save it. Bam, he's down. Well, at least he, he got some idle time. Spears are coming and now trying to control with more army and walling as well. Oh boy. So he's full of scouts. Kerasul. Make the market soon. Well, he's not mining gold yet, so no point. This is an archery. Oh, nice. An archery range. I like it. I don't want to see all these scouts and they need to castle it. Come on, aggression. Vamos. He's doing horse collar now. Archery range. It will take a while, anyway, to for the range to make an impact. But the spear almost doing a good damage there. Going back a little bit. No, no, no. And he's going for the hill. The spear is going to defend a lot. Viper has the spears? Yes, he has. Where the spears are? Well, I don't know. When you click there and they don't appear, it's because both are in different spots. Idols for the snake. But he fixed it right away. How many fish? Wow, that's five. Five fish ships. He's opponent only two. Oh, wow. Ooh! The spears there are sneaking the fish. This is very good for the Viper. Yeah, like, like really good. Look at his economy. He lost three fishing ships already. Yeah, all the three fishing ships. So, right now, massive economy lead for the snake. It's mining goal. He's doing the, the, the blacksmith. So, I like Viper position a lot. Like, really, really a lot. Now, he's moving away. And those archers are going to make Hera going back. And Hera has all the scouts approach with the Saracens. He's doing the archery range now. Oh, my God. Another village down. And he's going to take another one. <laughs> Another one. another one. He lost a scout, but that scout has been worth it, man. He's killing already six villains to the Canadian. Six villains, man. What the hell? Six villains kill. You kidding me, man? Okay. He's going around now with the six scout, two archers. Hmm. Oh boy. Six scout, three archers now. And he's gonna wall till this area. Not really. But that's the thing, I mean... Ooh! I, I mean, I like the demo choice, but why he didn't have something ready? I mean, you can't be playing open when your opponent has a lot of a scout. This is the only way where now he could do a good job. Here. No, no, no. Okay, he took the spears, but... He's gonna make a fire galley, sending the army. All right. But he should have something early. He might have he got the demo ready. And he has good economy, so he could have that. Now now he needs to go away. He's gonna lose another fish. He will. He lost it. And now it's raining less. 6-2. Population 55-40. Well, it's still raining, you know? Yeah. It's still raining and Hera doesn't have a good umbrella right now <laughs> to be defending. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay. He's gonna be able to take it. He has Fletching and those arches. He's going very aggressive. Resources, though, looking good. That he has a market. With the market, he could go up. The Canadian has the market. He has sold the stone and everything. But even like that, he does have a great economy in cooperation. Because he's being aggro, you know. Hola, the Cape Man! Thank you, man. Tire free subscriber. Magic Max, hello. Hello, Happy everyone. New year, man. Vamos, amigos, let's enjoy. The Viper and Hera is always a great moment to see, right? What we can be the comparing this? Messi, Ronaldo, Nadal, Federer, you know, stuff like this, right? Oh boy. The, the two big ones right now. I believe so, that they are the number one and two, right? Yeah, for a while, I would say. Lear was competing the last year. 
Well, Lear was competing with uh, the Grand Melee and NAC4. Is Lear gonna be competing at the same level in NAC5? That's the question mark, because Tatot is gonna be there. Mr. Yu is gonna be there. We are also wondering how Doubt is gonna make it, how good he's gonna make it, right? But I think the big question mark for NAC5, I don't know if you agree, guys, is Leary, right? Because with the others, we all expect to, to see them, you know, at their best, probably. Okay. I know that Larry is Larry, but let's see. He has been traveling. He has been traveling. Oh. Okay, more archers. Yes. 11 archers. And now six scouts. Okay. Total domination. Okay, doing the market here. Mike, Mike Masome, thank you, man, for the six moons. Apologize, guys, for the subscriber chat mode. I hate it because with this, you know, almost 2,000 viewers, I love to see the, the hype in the chat and everything, but spoilers can be can happening. This is recorded games, remember? It happened yesterday, these finals. I couldn't cast, but now we are casting it. So thank you guys for joining. If you didn't watch it, or you watch and also you are watching today, it, well, that makes me only feel proud and, and my gratitude is insane that you watch. But if you didn't, let's enjoy it together with the crazy series for sure. We see how the Viper is already there with the Castle Age, with the crossbows. He's going to be able to break in. He's trying. 66 population, 57. He has the heal advantage. So if he's not doing the damage now, Hera will be able to hold. The problem is that Malians get ballistic so quick. Yeah, the upgrades are so fast. Look how fast it is. Even the same time that he's doing Botkin. And with Ballistic, of course, Hera is amazing micro, but he's going to be able to dodge the arrows with the snake. Oh, baby. It's so difficult. So difficult, Ballistic. He knows that Ballistic is there. But now, the Canadian... Oh, look, one minute. It's take a lot longer to take. Population Viper is ahead. Three TCs, guys. 3 TCs is starting really well. And he's gonna take this one. Ooh. Okay. Gotta be careful. One. No, no, no. Now he should kill Villas or all the archers. This is the question, right? He has here 11 archers. His opponent 9. He's gonna have Ballista, but he's still killing Villas. Oh my god. The economy difference is just too much. He's really crazy. 46 population, 70. He's killing a lot. Look at the migration. And the snake is starting insanely good in this one. As you can see, he's taking everything, man. Oh, baby. Okay. Well, not looking great for Hera. He has 15? 15 army now. Yes. Check the village number, guys. What the hell? Echo KD. Echo KD. Echo KD, man. 24-2, man. Come on. Come on. Siege Workshop. And RT range. Still going with more and more crossbows. I mean, the Viper know that he has a massive advantage. It's crazy how the score say only 700 points. He should be 2,000. But yeah, look at the KD. Yes. It just... I mean, this is a game for the Viper to lose. But we all know that Hera control the army so well. If he's able now to make a good attack, this is Scorpions even coming. It's impossible. I mean, we'll see. We'll see what he can do. Uh oh. The Scorpion is there. Yeah, the Scorpion will help a lot. GG, man. GG, guys. The first game has been a brutal domination by the Viper. Uh, the early advantage with the economy matters a lot. It just matters, and definitely Hera couldn't come back here. And from there, he, it makes that, even against a civilization like the Saracens, the Viper got the timing advantage. Just look, 1844, it was 45 seconds. But, Mal uh, but Malians get the bonus on the university. He get ballistic right away. And then look at the economy overall. We doubled the goal. It was a destruction, really. Game number two, let's go. That was a quick 
First game. Oh boy. A quick first game. I will play an at. Yes. Let me play an at in between the games. Okay. It was solid. Game two. What is going to be? Let me go for the draft. And uh, I'll show you the possibilities. Right? This is 1 0. 1 0 here. And we have Malians won, Saracens lost. If Popopotos come in Hagen or Rocky Forest, they can pick whatever they want, but yeah, and they, they pick Outcrap. Guys, Outcrap is gonna be game number two. So, what are going to be the civilizations in that map, guys? Outcrap. Oh boy. Oh, really, boy? Outcrap, amigos. Outcrap. Yeah. Okay, are you ready for game number two? Game number two. Outcrap. Okay. And uh, this is game number two. Hera Industanis, the Viper Portuguese. Oh, wow. We see into studies again. Well, this is the good thing with the new balance patches, right, guys? To see civilization that they were pretty much, uh, how to call it this in English, demoted. Is that a correct uh, word for what I'm trying to say? Pretty much, like they, they, they were, you know, at the bottom of everything. And now Hindustan is, is, is a guy, you know? Yeah, nerf is... It, it was a nerf. It was just demoted for, for so long, you know? You know? Tugel is at the back. Look at the goal. He's doing the... The house. He's gonna be trying to wall. Let's check the Viper map, and then we go on Hera. Bear is in front. He could wall this easily. All this area. This is a little bit more open, but the map in general is more or less easy to wall here. You know? Yeah, there's only two goals, and then everything else is on this, let's say, desertical area. Yeah, because the other is grass, right? So, yeah. Also, much bigger on the left than the right one. I don't know who could that benefit mo the most. Hera has berries in front, both goal in front. It's similar to the Viper, not really. Viper is at the back, and he's in front. Not super in front, because also you can wall. This area not very difficult to wall. And it's stone? There's no stone. It's only in the desert area or desertical area where the stone is. I still think that I prefer Portuguese. You know? I think Portuguese is still better civilization. But what Hindustanis can do here? I mean, cheaper village is okay. But if you have camels. Your opponent can go halves. It's momentum. I believe this new percentage doesn't change anything. And then why now people it's pick in the studies? It didn't change anything. They wouldn't pick Mr. Jimmy Raynor. Because now the players are picking in the studies and not before, right? Well. Is 3% only in Dark Age? I think they increase it, if I'm not mistaken. It has to matter, because now we have seen Industanis more than one time. Yeah, and also the other day won Industanis. I don't remember what match was. It was... Imperial Camels versus... Versus what? Versus Malian's Camels versus Farimba, it was. Okay. 8, 13, 18. Well, it's 8%. Now it's, it's 8%. So it matters, man. Oh, versus Saracens. It was versus Saracens. You are right. It was Saracens, not, not Malians. Because it was 170 HP camels. And they destroyed it. Obviously, the, the numbers matters. And there was a lot more army from... Uh, I think it was Mr. Yo. Right? I think so. Anyway. Both are up. 
Hindustan is and Portuguese. It's going to be a stable again. I mean, it has been a while that it was never scouts. Now it's always scouts. It's always scouts, right, guys? There's no militias. There's no men at arms. Barely archers open. What's happening, guys? What happened? Is correct that the Gurjara scams destroy Sarns and Camels? I think so. Because they have a crazy s armor. Also attack faster. If I'm not mistaken, when you make the upgrade. I'm not sure about the attack fast. It's too many saves. I even myself forget about these things. Whoa! A new Prime! Let's go, guys! Go, go, go! Don't forget, guys. The Prime is a great and huge support. Also the same with my beautiful VPN sponsor. If you need a VPN, this is the... The VPN you need. Oh, this is a lot of food for Hera. It is a lot of food for Hera. Well, 600 food, but he's recovering. And he's going to recover the other? Oh, baby. The snake. Oh, he missed it. He missed those 300. Well, it's a lot of food. Yeah, extra damage, extra attack speed. I know that. I know the extra attack speed. Uh oh. Careful. Uh, it's very close to the TC, no problem. Should palisade here, maybe. It's not. And little by little, he's walling. It feels that now it's gonna be all these scouts. No RT range? Look at Viper re resources here. Not good macro, guys. Oh my god. I've never seen that... That happening to the Viper. Well, I mean, never. Not often. Yeah, almost 700 wood, guys. What the hell? Obviously, you get a lot of wood extra... Well, a lot. Wood extra from from Portugal, but you need to spam farms. It's true that he's taking all these herdables, so he's using all the villages on on this food. That's why he's not doing farmers earlier. So it's okay. Also, you can always make the market. Uh oh, scout and spears. Why the Viper? Why Hera is a little bit... Be, is behind? Yes. Viper is a little bit ahead. Do you know... Can you tell me why? It's more than five seconds the Viper ahead with the Valir. You know why, right? I mean, if they didn't lose any Valir, right? It's because the Loom is being researched faster for Portuguese. Like, those techs are faster. And then it's time that you're winning. Exactly. Portuguese stakes are faster. There's so many things to know in this damn game. Thank you for the follow. Welcome, everyone. Remember, guys, that we are also streaming in 1440p. We are streaming only on Twitch today. You know? And we are watching... Well, Hera and Viper that are pretty sick. The players, man. Middle East tournament. You know? 2,000 euros, if I'm not mistaken, on the price. And best of seven grand final is exactly NAC 5 setting. So this is like for Warlords was the Warlords waiting room, basically. Pretty much the same. Okay. And we have already Hera and Viper here with the full focus. You could maybe expect, no, oh, man, maybe this player seems is close to the, you know, we are in Christmas time, we're close to the new, new Year's Eve. They're gonna be more chill and they want to rest. Nah! Heron Viper are here practicing, being on point, and see now with what? Six scout, four spears, ten army. Hera with more army than the Viper now. Yeah, but here's the archery range. Problem with the archery range is that Hera now should be able to go up to Castlech quicker. I believe so. Uh oh. That archer is gonna go around. Ooh! not working ay, 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 a little bit slower than usual because he could have trapped those scouts would be would be lovely but now as i'm telling you check Hera's economy guys he's not wall but he doesn't really need to wall his opponent is fully defending at home because he's forcing him to defend and check the resources guys okay heavily on the on the market is safe and you don't lose anything. But the efficiency is not the highest. The resources. Okay, look at this now. What the hell? 
he had millions of villages on the queue or what? It seems so. At the end, he's not too far. And now Hera is going to go up. Look how fast they are. They are up. 15 minutes. And in this one, they are doing quite a lot of scout, a lot of spears, trying to be aggressive. No problem. I multitask as fast as you can, Mr. Memp. Okay, Mr. Hera. And he's up, guys. 38 villages, 11 army. He's going to wall here. And uh, damn. The Viper is up to 30 seconds behind, but he has one villager more. So at the end, no problem. He lost one villager Viper, but uh, 24 seconds at TC. So it's pretty much the same. It compensates that villager loss. Uh oh. It's not walling? Nah. Oh. Think he's gonna lose that villager? Nah. He has the army there. He's not losing anything. Position. Very similar. Yes. And now he's doing a skirms. So, should it happen anything? Ooh, he's gonna lose this villager. He will. Yeah, yeah, he couldn't save it. He's already two villages killed. With two scouts only, and he managed to kill a villager. That's solid. Another archery range. Question is, what? Crossbows? I wanna see cav arches for any of the players? I believe no. Like, uh oh, fletching now. If he's Look how he's trying to avoid. What the hell? I mean, seriously? He's gonna save it? No. Okay, he saved one. He saved it one. Still, Hera resources looks so healthy. So much more healthy. Check, guys. Look at the resources he has. Now what? Pozo, extra TC in the outside. He's gonna do what? Fletching now. Being without fletching and doing few camels. Yeah. The Viper? Eh? Well... A little bit less wood than his opponent. And he's going for a TC on that area too, on that desertical area. He's doing the crossbow, upgrade, the botkin arrow, while well, his opponent is doing the least skirmishes, which also costs wood. But he can afford it, as you can see. And no bozo for the Viper. Oh man. Rona MacArthur! 45 moons! Vamos! Vamos. It's not that Viper is slower, it's that when you have to control uh, several and different kind of units, it's more complicated, you know? And, well, that was the case here. Let's go, Fala Mage! How you doing, man? Afternoon, ma'am. I know that you see in the north, I know that you see here, the back, and... We have three camels, six skirmishers, now doing the extra tone center. It's gonna work well. Ooh, okay. I see all the lover boys joining. I see all the people in the channel. All the faces are obviously more people that sadly with the subscriber mode, they are not speaking, but they are there. Yeah, man, awesome. Really, really awesome. Amazing. I didn't expect to get so many viewers with the recorded games, but you guys love the game as much as I do, right? Well, or very close, or very, very close. Uh-oh, careful there. Yeah, look at those cameras and the skirmishes. Now, population is very similar. Siege Workshop, the combination is, is strong here for Hera, because now the Viper cannot do knights. Yeah. He cannot. There's some crossbows here. Another TC in this area. It's true that the yellow color here is a little bit more complicated to spoil. To see. I will put now his point of view. So then we can see it better. Oh, Airfare Air, JJ, man. How you doing? JJJ. One, two, three tone centers. Well, I was annoyed yesterday with myself because I couldn't cast, but, well, here we are. Scorpions! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. The monk? Nah, he's not gonna see it. I'm going to her point of view now. Micro has to be really important here. 77, 74 is the same population. The game is extremely close. More army for Viper, less villages. Okay. The camels are strong. Just take the stable, but the stable now is kinda irrelevant. I mean, it's always better to have it, but, you know... Rodos and Scorpions. Mm. 8177. Be careful there. 
University, okay. And how many farms? A few farmers. Yeah, I was with with family and friends yesterday. Also, the, they told me that this tournament was going to happen today, so that's why I took the day off yesterday with the family. And then uh, the Viper Dad messaged me, Hey, man, the tournament is now. Are you coming? I need, to, I need your casting. And I said, I'm not. I'm in another city, man. The tournament wasn't supposed to be today, but well, it's what it is. Oh, careful. Now he's gonna be able to take it or not. This is a good amount of farming here. A lot of scorpions. The camas are not the greatest against this. And with the Crotus, if you micro properly, you might kill all the camels. And he is killing all the camels. The Viper has the military advantage for sure. And now with Ballistic, pretty sick. Hera, in the meanwhile, has a better economy, like by far. 40 farmers, look at the resources collected already. Yeah, but this is the thing. His army is better, he can raid. But look at the resources, looking good. Are we gonna see Gulams? Gulams could be great, but he's not mining even a stone. He can see the stone. He didn't explore, but you should explore a little bit better. And that's it. These skirmishes are plus two, plus two. Look how strong he is to have the plus two armor. He barely can take damage in those skirmishes. It's crazy. Yeah, just look how many shots he's needed. They don't die, man. The skirmishes are so tanky. My goodness. Yeah, well, now he's a lot of archers, right? But still, it's take a while. All right. And now it's stables. But guys, if he's preparing... Oh, I like this. Hera is not being greedy. He's going to do army, right? Yeah, if he's doing army, he's going to be fine because his economy is very solid. Like, really, really solid. We'll see. The stable at home. It's now coming with the mangonels. Remember that Portuguese has many, many tools, like monks, they are great. Oh, he has a stone for a castle. But he's coming with the mangonels and, and, and the camels. You gotta be careful. Uh-oh, Belia down. Ooh, this is a forward castle. The Viper going aggressive. Gonna take this TC. He's true that he's moving on the left, but that's huge, actually. The mangonel, eh, okay. He can't see the mangonel now. Let's see if he's gonna notice. He didn't, but he didn't steal and didn't kill it. Wow, that was a that was lucky for Viper. Yeah, no, no, no. What? That wasn't the best micro. And now, lost the mangrove too. This castle is up. I'm gonna mine more stone. I'm gonna start to lose village here. Yeah, that's that's pretty sick. He's ballistic, so he's gonna lose a lot. Skirmishes are coming. Population Viper is still ahead. But you gotta be careful. Ballistic for Hera. Yeah. But he's starting to kill a lot. Viper is now ahead in army, ahead in villiers, ahead in everything. In map control as well. This Scorpion is going to help a lot against the skirmishes. Whoa, 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 whoa. Great aggression by the snake. But in the meanwhile, this is also a counterattack. Hmm. I don't know. But now Viper seems to be in, in the winning position here. Obviously, Hera resources still floating. The possibility to go up 30. What? 13 villains on, on the queue? What the hell, man? Well, they're so cheap, but my goodness. He could go up to Imperial then. Still not mining a stone. He can see that there is a stone there. Okay, Skirmishes versus Organ Guns. The Organ Guns gonna eat for bre What? Do you have a Mangonel? I don't know. Well, it's too fine. And those camels? We go down, right? Yeah, absolutely. They disappear, man. The camels disappear. It's still not the best resources in the bank for the Viper. He has only seven on coal, now heavy plow. No will borrow, which is matters a lot too. But he's still attacking, man, and killing more villains. Look at the Echo KD, guys. The Echo KD is insane. The Viper has 18 kills. And even like that, he's only six villains behind, Hera. He's now doing redemption. Okay. Forgot that Hindustani's monks are, are, are so good, man. Yeah, they are. 
But look at the population for the snake. Is he starting to control uh, the map? He still has a lot of food here, but not close to go up at all. He's not pushing that town center. But Viper need to explore on the left. He's now going to go with knights, maybe. It's really important. Oh, man. Guys, the Viper has a stone to drop another castle. This is why he needs to explore here, because if he put the castle on the left, what resources left for Hera? Yeah, the snake is playing amazing right now. It was looking very good for Hera at some point, but this castle kind of changed everything. Well, not only the castle out, so he's doing a lot of farming. Not being greedy for, for a change. Oh boy. But these schemes are really, really great. Wow, it's incredible. Both are up to Impede at the same time, basically. What the hell? Hera is up with 117 villains. Look at the army numbers. He's doing the castle on the left to have control all over the map. Light caps now. And let's see in Imperial because camels and hand cannoneers doesn't look terrible. But if he's doing golems, can be great as well? Well, I don't know. Remember the guys that Portuguese got champions. Cavaliers, arbalists, hand cannoneers, bomber cannons with archivus that is basically with ballistic gun power units. They have a crazy tech tree, but Hindustanis have some very good tools as well. Let's see what they're going to do. But the game is going to Imperial with both in a very, very close situation. My goodness. Castle is going to be up. Okay. And lost the army on the left. But this castle with only one Valir? I mean, seriously? It, it really do It's... Don't speak loud, guys. Look. Here he's coming. He's only one of And he's coming. Now I gotta speak loud, man. What the hell, man? I mean, seriously. Are you... You gotta be kidding me, man. I mean, for real? But Hera... What? <laughs> he sent the village away. And Hera is not even trying. Okay. Sounds good to me. On the other side, he's coming now with light caps. He's going trying to convert. So many crossbows. He's gonna take this. Okay, chain bar and armor in beetle for both. 170 population. Hera, 153. Amount of farming insane for the Viper. Not a lot of farming for, for Hera. And what is he planning to do? He has two villages on gold only. He deleted that castle and now he's in Imperial as well. Viper with a plus three. I like how this game is going for the snake. Yeah, he has a solid position here. Don't need the TC. Oh, stop micro like my mods. Come on. Yeah, okay. He's going to go back. Mangal, look at those light caps. He's going to try to push here. But at home, doing the castle. He's afraid. The Viper? A potential rating? Maybe. He's letting, letting all this area for, for Hera, which is great for the Canadian. But his number, the same for both, as you can see. But army numbers now? Yeah, it's not the greatest for Hera. I probably... He maybe doesn't know really what to do now. Well, he's going for Khazars. But Arbalis is dangerous, man. Like, very dangerous. Oh my god, another castle. I mean, the Viper knows that Hera loves to do exactly what he's doing right now with the with the light caps to raid. But you can wall. But he's not walling. Arbalists are coming, guys. He's going to the farmers. Scores still say that the snake is taking a solid lead. As you can see, more light caps. He's gonna go back or not? Ooh. Okay. Gotta be careful. Going back a little bit. <clears throat> Sorry, guys. Hand card, plus three, chemistry. Still going aggressive. Military numbers is double. The Viper 200 population. 200 population. Also, Portugal has the possibility of Fightorias if needed. Not a map that you're gonna need because you have a lot of resources. Chamber and armor, heavy camels. Heavy camels are great. Imperial camels are even better. But what you need is a counter for the Arvales. Is the camels a good counter for the Arvales? Well, Imperial camels definitely kill all, but. But a long way for those Imperial camels. Here I still have a, a healthy population according to the situation. The snake is still coming. Chemistry. Plate bard and armor. And he's gonna come here for a forward castle. Oh man. He still have good farmers here. Two tone centers and moving more economy, but the red is now real. The Viper is the one who is ready now. 
Yes. 45 moments, Trukman. Thank you, man. The castle is forward. Yeah, it's a great one. Papa has three relics, two relics for Hera. And the snake seems to, to be getting the game number two. Two zero against Hera. Don't remember. The Viper being two zero lead against the Canadian in a long time. In tournaments, I'm talking, you know, and yeah, I'm not sure, to be honest. Uh-oh, be careful. Be really careful. It's true, guys, that this matchup in Warlords didn't happen, right? I think Viper and Hera didn't, ma didn't, didn't face in Warlords. Definitely not. Uh-oh, careful here. Yeah, it didn't happen. Let's see the Arbalest. Okay. Gotta be careful. He's going back a little bit. Okay. He's still going. 170 population, 200 population. Yeah, right. So, oh, he's trying to make the castle, but he can't delete it and make one tile. For what? Don't leave the... Oh, mistake. Mistake. He's doing the castle now. You need to repair the trap. You need to send one camel here to defend. Hera is still holding with 176 population. Yeah. It's crazy that he is still in the game. Obviously, check his resources. Imperial Camel! Imperial Camel right now. Oh, boy. But some Bombard Cannon will help a lot here to try to take those trebuchets because you don't want to lose that castle. The Camels will eat the light caps. Yes, they will. Bombard Cannon incoming? Not really. And he still have some good resources. Two traps to kill those. We'll see. Viper's still going. He's with Arvales. He got the skirmishes here. And those skirms in danger against the light caps. But the castle will, will cover. This is fine. This is really fine. Imperial camels in one minute. How many camels he got? 12. Not too many. Viper is still trying to put all the pressure. And he is doing. Definitely it is. Not the trap there. So, in the south, Hera is completely fine. He need to hold this area. He's going to be able to hold. I think he will. I think he will hold. The Bombard Cannon is coming. If he stop those traps, Imperial Camels and Skirmishers might be able to, to stop this. I don't know what you think, guys, but this is not Imperial Camels. It's still heavy Camels. Skirmishers are coming. Look at now Hera. Oh my god, look at the army numbers. Look at the army numbers. He's gonna take absolutely everything. Imperial Camels are there. And now the Canadian is coming back from the hell. You need house. The Arvalis disappear. And look at the army numbers. Whoa. Population era 200 population. The Viper 170. And without house, this army is gonna be melt. Clean for the face of this area and this planet. That's why Pike went up right now. Doing the hand card. Okay, 65 farmers. And he's completely fine in the south. Wow. Remember that the Imperial Camels got 160 HP. Not bad. Not bad. Crazy Camels. Yeah, they have more HP than the Saracens one. But the attack also is 8 plus 4. They are solid, man. They are very, very solid. And for Camels, also some good armor. Yeah, plus three melee, plus four pierce armor. That's fine. Conscription. Hera is gonna take this castle down. Oh, no. But he's going to convert the Bombard Cannon. He's trying to convert the Bombard. He converted. He's now gonna lose it. Okay, but the castle is down. And it's crazy how the Canadian, in a very terrible position, is pushing it back with 200 population constantly. Now the Viper is doing the halves. Great. So we might see... <clears throat> Sorry, Gulams or Hand Cannoneers from Hera? I believe so. Potentially it can happen. Because now Halts and Arbales are very solid combo. He's doing camels, but Skirmishes is an oath. Well, he's ready now. He's ready, the Viper. Oh, man. Oh, man, look at the score, guys. Look at the score. Crazy game. Crazy second game. Awesome. Okay. Over 1,000 score difference. He's going to rate. I believe that we will see Kassars as well. Yeah, I guess so. Siege Engineer. Uh-oh. He's gonna shoot into the into the Arbales. Look, 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 look. He's gonna try. Ooh! Good shot. But didn't achieve anything, right? 
Anyway, the cameras are now raiding, guys. Are raiding. Viper is, Viper is losing now, Velis. Viper killed it a lot to Hera. But he's still 150, Velis, man. Deco KD is almost irrelevant right now. Resources, solid for both. The Viper is still with three relics. Castle here. Trebuchet to take this castle, and the castle is going to be down. He's recovering all the map, guys. It's recovering all the map. Oh, my lord. Really? Yeah, there is nothing here. Okay. Castle is up. Another castle down. Now he's doing the upgrades for the Halberdiers. But the problem for Viper is that he's losing all the mobility, guys. Yeah, his resources are okay. A lot of food. Oh, the goal is definitely not... Not okay. And uh, a lot of stone. A lot of stone. Oh, man. But he's spamming, guys. Hera is not letting the Viper recover. It's not that the Viper has to recover a lot, but he needs to mass more army. I mean, he has 54, more than Hera, but... His halves, Arbalest, and yeah, some light caps. But the Imperial Camels, 31 Imperial Camels. 31 Imperial Camels raiding completely now. Oh, man. Oh, man. Look how they are killing the Arbalest, guys. The lonely Arbalest. Obviously, if the halves arrive, it's different, but... Arbal is in the hell. In the hell. They still have a lot of army because the production is high. But he's raiding completely. It's Phil. It's Phil a snowball game now. For, for Viper. Yeah, that is crazy. It was looking so good, man. And now the 2,000 score different for Hera. Hazards. 33 farmers is not the best, but still has a lot of food in the bank. Hazards coming. When the game is going for Hazar situation, you know that this is dangerous for Hera's opponent. Hera played with Hazars more or less okay. He played okay. All right, guys? Yeah. <laughs> anyway, Skirmish is going back. The traps are in danger. The camels are coming, but is it not camels to, to take this? No. But with those camels that are coming from behind, yes, it is. Sending traps to that castle. Hera is just playing amazing now. Really good. It's not that Viper is doing mistakes, honestly. It's just that he da he he's not finding the answers. Of course, he has now traps here and the halves are coming. Missing the plus four. Come on, do it. It's not the lead organ guns. He has the kill advantage here. Population hold the Viper with 200. Hera with almost 200 as well. The castle is gonna be down and the Viper seems to be holding. He's coming back the Viper from the hell or not? Look at the castle here to defend the farmers. In the south, Hera has expanded with many castles. One, two, three castles. He has all the south. Viper is still fine in the north. So it's kind of feel that now the game stabilized and it's kind of even. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see now, still mobility is needed. And mobility is still better situation for Hera. With the 22 Imperial Camels and potential Hazars. Yeah, but Farmers, now 57. Oh boy, still raiding. Ooh. Ooh. Doing a ton center in this area. I will have done the TC here, but still. And it's coming again with the Trebuchets. Who is winning this game? I don't know. I really don't know who is winning this game now. Every outcrap game goes over an hour. It's true. Like, almost every game, almost every game in this map is going long, right? I mean, the map is big. It's really big. You really need to kill so quick. But Viper was killing. But Kira expanded in the south and gave him the chance to, to come back there. I don't think also... The Viper did Arkebus, right, guys? I don't think he did it. I also don't think Hera did the upgrade for the goal income faster. No. Also, not Siege Engineer. Uh, he's missing a lot of upgrades here. He's missing a lot of upgrades, but those Halberd these guys are doing a massacre. The Imperial Camels are now in the hell, guys. The Imperial Camels are in the hell. The Viper has killed here a lot. Really, really a lot. He's taking now all the trebuchets. Yes, he is. Oh, now headshot in the bomber cannon, but more bomber cannons. Bam. 
Now the halberd deers and well, it's kind of easier to play this with the halves, right? But mobility, ooh, I told you, mobility, man. Hazards are now coming. A lot of hazards. The problem is that now is the Viper doing any damage on Hera's economy for the last 15 minutes? I mean, since he got pushed back here, is the Viper doing any damage on Hera? I don't think it is, right? And that's the problem here. That's the problem here. Oh, I was scared. I thought that they would call it, but no. Yeah, it's 200 pop right now. Score difference is still ahead for, for Hera, but doesn't matter too much. It's because the KD is just higher, much higher. Trebuchet down. More organ guns, plus four now. He was missing those upgrades. Still seven on gold only. I don't know why. There's plenty of resources for the snake. Yeah, he should take more. But he's not taken. Yeah, he has seven on gold, zero on a stone with all these crazy resources. That surprised me. A lot. Oh, monk down. The game kind of slowed down a little bit. It seems that now it's more complicated for both to... Well, for one to push and the other is defending properly, so... Oh, man. Look at this. Was trying to, to kill with Bomber Cannon the Hazard. Oh, more Hazards. More Hazards gonna be raiding. Trevich is also taking the castle. He's still trying to go into his economy and he will. He will now. How many? 12 Hazard. Well, but the helps are there. Should be fine. Oh my god. Those Hazards just melt. Still killing a lot. The KD is getting closer. It's going to convert one half. All right. Which is not so important. And the traps. Gonna take this castle. He should go and take those trebuchets. The Viper sell 600 food for 164 gold. But I don't understand this. He got a lot of gold to mine. My goodness. Take some gold. Yeah. I mean, selling a lot of resources when you don't have a lot of food in the bank is bad when you can take a lot of gold. Yeah, if you had like 20 bullets on gold, it would be fine. Great stream. Uh, yeah. Thank you, man. Thank you so much. That's the problem. Well, Viper is out of wood, out of all the resources. Crazy. It's absolutely crazy. Hera's resources collected 7,000 more. 8,000 more right now. You can't take in the, in the, at the bottom in the panels. But he's going all the halves now, basically. Well, two light caps and... The bomber cannons. He's pushing it back or trying. Still 200 population. What the hell? Crazy. Crazy. Guys, don't you think that right now, hand cannoneers with the resources Hera has would be brutal? They have nine range, guys. You know, the hand cannon is for Industani, they have nine range, and you need to kill those halves. I mean, the skimmers are fine, but hand cannon ears are, are epic here. Oh my god, almost losing the bomber cannons. Oh, he got it. He got it. He's gonna take it or not? 55 55. Well, same population or almost. Uh, bomber cannon down. Okay. Now Fort Travis is gonna take it. Ooh. Ooh. Not really. He's pushing now completely. Yeah, he's taking out he's taking out those traps. More army for Hera, yes. But this army is stronger. The bomber cannons are stronger. Uh-oh. Now with the siege engineer for sure. For both players. The monks are coming. Piper has no army, man. In comparison, look at the resources for the Canadian guys. What is this economy? My goodness. 70 farmers, 48 farmers. Well, it's just a better village distribution. 129, 199. More wood. Food gold. And look at those. Uh oh. Oh, nice shot into the bomber cannon. It's going to take this castle. I think. Oh, relics are gone. Is he gonna notice the Viper? I don't know if he's gonna notice. But as you can see, 
The Viper cannot push anymore. He's getting raided. Look at the Echo KD. It was super ahead for the Viper. And now, Kara has killed more villains than his opponent. You know? And that is slowly is making that the Viper is having no Echo to keep going. No Echo to keep going. And I have the feeling that Hera and Industanis are taking the snake. Yeah, he's raiding, guys. He's raiding. Echo KD is still exploding more and more. Oh, man. Yeah, look at now the Khazars and Trebuchet. He's all over now. Yeah, he's all over. All over. And the Viper is going to have to surrender here. Yeah, he's moving and that's the problem. No mobility. He's still here, so those bullets are in danger. And there's no wood, guys. Look at the wood here. Oh, my God. The Lumberkin. Yeah, no wood, guys. He has a lot more wood, uh, Hera. I think so. Mm. Yeah, but look at the raid, man. Look at the raid. Viper is just losing all his economy. 88 villains, man. What the hell? 88 villains. He won't be able to, to, to do too much anymore soon. Doing his tables on his face. Taking the TC. What the hell? Viper is trying to recover the relics. Two relics now. Skirises are there, but... It's taking all the economy, really. Yeah, Viper has now dropped the population. He has still have more army than, than, than Hera. That way he's still going. But if Hera keep raiding, just look at the Echo KD now. It's 150, 104. And it was at some point 70, 10 for the Viper. Something like this. That's crazy. I mean, just check the resources for one. Check the resources for the other. So it, it's, it's impossible. That now Viper can counter all this, even if he has more army, you cannot move. And now he's gonna take more echo, more and more, more and more, more and more, constantly, non-stop. Yeah, and with the helps. Okay, he's now moving from the north to the south, but in the meanwhile, taking traps. GG has been called. Brutality game by the Canadian. Ridiculous. Yeah, brutality game. The Viper was, guys, the Viper was here. He was here and Hera was having this army and then a little bit that he moved here. But then he did the Bomber Cannons, took the Traverses back and when he did the Imperial Camels, he dominated. He really, really dominated. Yeah, well, 1-1, one, one, guys. 1-1, one, one, statistics, mobility matters, man. Mobility matters and you can see here, it can't, well, 200 kills more. Economy, oh my god. At the end, it's normal. He was ready, so it was taking a lot. Let's go, game three. Game number three, guys. Game number three, I will show you the... The draft. I need to go to the bathroom one moment, and we will keep going. But I will show you the draft. Okay. I think it's... Let me just see it. The draft. We keep going. 1-1, one, one, guys. 1-1. One, one. Pretty crazy, that game, honestly. It was looking that he could win, but, but Industanis won to Portuguese. So we have seen a civilization like Industanis not being picked at all, and now they won Portuguese. What happened? Well, brutality gameplay. Okay, guys, we keep going. As I was telling, they can pick whatever they want. Thank you for the soup, man. Okay, guys, and we have now game number three, guys. Ooh! Hera Franks, the Viper, Armenians. Armenians. Gonna make something dirty. Honestly, the middle card in a map like this is nice, you know? Because you can move those and you cannot make Lumber Camps in the rock area. You cannot, right? So that's a problem. That with Armenians or Georgians? You see the Lumber Camp that he has to do it? And you cannot wall. So it's good to move it. But what is he going to do? Do you prefer Franks or Armenians? I think Franks is easier to play. And against a player like Hera, poof, 
I don't know. Who who make the first big Dravidians? The Viper? Oh, Hera! Hera! He can't win, man. <laughs> anyway, disaster, man. Aye, aye, aye. Aye, aye, aye. Okay. Let me... One moment. Okay. Let me put the microphone close to my mouth to be this professional, guys. Brutality professional. What do you prefer, guys? Franks or Armenians? Can you tell me? Tell me, guys. Tell me, guys. Okay. Someone promised Kera 50 suits if he picks them first? Really? My goodness, man. Unbelievable. Don't waste a beer. Thank you for the soup, guys. Oh my god. Remember, guys, that the, the subscriber chat is done not for, for you to, to force to subscribe or to promote that. No, it's because we don't want to get spoiled. <clears throat> this series was played yesterday, but we are casting today. I couldn't cast live, you know. And obviously, if you subscribe, well, more than welcome, guys. Also, you will not see any ads anymore. And uh, I don't know, but I think we, we have a, a nice channel, right? So thank you so much for the support. Awesome. <clears throat> okay. You see, this is why the mule card is great efficiency here. It, it's, it's amazing, you know? It's really amazing. Okay. Well, with the map, they... they they pick probably Dravidians. He will play in Copenhagen, you know. Boom Wars! Thank you for the Prime, man. Why are Manians here? Well, I mean, as I say, this build card here is great for the wood. You can relocate. The wood is not wallable. And uh, if you want to go full infantry, you know, it might da it might do damage because you cannot wall. But the longest the game goes. I believe it's the better for Franks. No? I guess it's, it's the better for Franks, really. I, I might be wrong, we'll see. You know, we'll really see. Okay. Anyway. <clears throat> He's coming forward, as you can see. He's coming forward right now. Archie range. One moment, guys. I'm checking something. Okay. Yeah, I was checking something, guys. Sorry. Yeah, he's doing a scout. So he's coming already with the spears and the scout. He has the archery range and now he's doing the middle card. He wants to control this area to have crazy resources. The scouts here, well, if he mass some of them, might do the damage. But if not, problem for Hera. He's trying to kill the skirmisher, but... Yeah, now the micro here for the Viper has to be on point. Well, for both. And this is what Hera is trying to do. I believe that Hera will do exactly an archery range right away. Then a scout and a skirms. It's the best here, you know, definitely better. Uh oh, no, no, no. Yeah, eventually he will do also a stable. I don't know, but he's going, he's playing Byzantine styles. Uh oh, no, no, no. Well, the scout is pretty much bye bye now, but you don't want to get any damage. Oh, he's not losing the scout. I like it. Look how he's controlling the army, both players. That's crazy, man. That's crazy. Hera 3 army, Viper 8. First kill and the scout. Ooh, it's not taken yet. No, no, no. But why he's going with the scout? I don't understand. When you have the scout with two HP, just go away. And out to scout. Explore all the map. I don't know. Like, why suicide that army? Sacrifice that army more than suicide, right? Anyway, he keeps coming aggressive. He has a lot of army, yes. But now he's starting to do skirmishers. 
is gonna be able to to take something without flinching and likely obviously you don't have the same uh, oh the same efficiency but he's also trying to attack and those scouts oh this area is dangerous nah he's fine it's going to be fine he's going now to the wood line there's only one skirmisher how do you defend this not easy but Vlad is so neat. It's a Scarface tired free subscriber, man. Holy moly, man. Pinary! Pinary, did you miss me yesterday? I did a stream yesterday after, guys. More than six or seven months stream in a row. You know? Or something like this. I think it has been my what? My. F yeah, man. Crazy. Oh, crazy. I think the last day off I got was in June or something. Did you miss it as, ma'am? I missed it some. I missed it some of the people, yes. Not you, Moti. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, let's see. No, don't be sad, Moti. Don't be sad. Of course, of course, of course. I miss my mod. The, the, the small treat mod. The the mod, uh, the dog, the the the, the higher fonts, the, the, you know, all those mods, yeah. Okay, let's see. Now with those spears and skirmishes, eight army thirteen. He's housed it, Hera. Need to do houses. Idle TC for the Viper. How is that home? Great economy already. I mean, I love to see Viper being aggressive, you know. But he probably feel that you have to be aggressive with this civilization, probably. <clears throat> Obviously, having Fletcher now is much better. The schemes are not going to be able to really hold pretty well. But the micro is so, so needed here. Yeah. Yeah, nobody's even mining gold. So, Scout skirmishes versus Byzantine styles. He's going to keep trying to attack, but at home? Ooh, sticking the foot on the left. And... Keras will know that he's on the left. And he's there, guys. Those bullets are going to the damn hell. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. You see? That's why you usually make a tower. But he didn't. Here, because he did where? On the wood. Now he's doing on the wood. He lost all those three villages. Yeah. He killed two vipers, so... The game is going quite close right now. It's mining gold. Not really. And the viper didn't see the, the berries. Damn. He take the mule card too. What the hell? Wow, that was a great move by, by Hera. He's one delay ahead only. Military numbers, Viper has more. But now, guys, Franks start to be so smooth. Really, really smooth. Also, Viper, no horse collar. While well, the horse collar for free for, for Franks. For the Canadian. And of course, I miss you, man. Did you see, did you see Moti, my, my message on, on Discord, man? I'm used to come with you guys, so... And when it's big, big events, if I cannot cast live, that's really rare. I feel bad, man. I cannot enjoy 100% if I'm doing something else. So I didn't enjoy yesterday 100% because I couldn't cast this live. But now I'm enjoying, and hopefully you are doing too. Because we have a great population for both players. Fletcher now is still not mining gold. This is crazy amount of farming for the snake. He holded the position and now he's gonna push him back. Yes, he will. The problem is, the transition, well, that's why he's doing the market. Might sell some resources. Okay. 33 moons, vamos, 7th spring. 7th string, string. <laughs> My throat is also killing me, and it's not because of talking. I think I'm, I, I got a little bit sick these days because I drink too much cold stuff when it's for what is the standard in my city is also cold. I know it's not cold for you, so I'm not gonna go with the weather and the temperature. But here, for what it is, it's cold. And a lot of humidity. My city has that problem. That is a lot of, there's a lot of humidity. But guys, the Viper managed to go up to Castleage faster than Hera with a lot of farming. So it's gonna be pikes and skirmishes. Okay. The game are, the game are the seas are extremely close, man. Really, really close. Oh, man. Okay. 
objectives. No, they are not mining stone. He's doing now, he did now the horse collar. And the spears, why they are away? I don't know. Trying to explore, probably. Another pillar down. And the market is going to be there. But what is the transition now? I like that. The stable is needed, man. You can't go all these skirms and pikes, in my opinion. Really. You can't. You have to do something else, too. To go with. Uh-oh. It's annoying. Look at the wood. It's exposed, for sure. But he's gonna even chop this area already. Oh, boy. Yeah, everything is open. This is the, 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 the tricky... The tricky thing here. Oh, the Pikeman upgrade. I forgot he can upgrade before Castleage. And that's what he did. Pikes dominate. This nice going down. Scout, sorry. No, no, no. No, no, no. Don't go yet. Guys, he can do now halves in Castleage. I mean, it's obviously very expensive and you don't want to do it. But he can do halves if he wanted, you know. Okay. Fortified church in this area. Is the gap here, so well, it helps. Not huge, but it helps. Remember that now you get one relic right away, which is also helps to get gold for free. Uh oh. Plus one armor for those spikes. You have to be careful. No, no, no. Skirmishes for both. Elite skirmishes for both. Yeah, those spikes, if he killed the knights. But not gonna be easy. He's coming with more knights, knight and skirmishes, the pikes. You need to micro. Not gonna be possible to kill. And now those skirmishes are going to the damn hell. That's why he focus on the skirms. And the army numbers are dropping and dropping and dropping. Here are doing the second tone center. Well, Viper is doing the second TC. No, he's not doing anything. Now he's doing, all right. All the army for the snake is gone. So how do you hold now the, the, the position? Well, he has the charge. He's going to make monks. He has knight as well and some pike. But he's going to make another TC on the goal and on the right side. The monk will help for sure. Three TCs, guys. He's now moving those bullets. He can take the relics. Oh, but the schemes are going to be deadly here the schemes are going to be deadly no 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 you need to go back oh a warrior priest interesting yeah but the warrior priest is not gonna help a lot against the knights this is a siege war shot problems problems for viper i mean franks is a lot smoother to play honestly i mean in a specific situations, situation, sorry, Armenians, Georgians, are, are they really powerful thieves? I think they are medi me mediocre civilizations. W what do you think, guys? I mean, I don't know. I mean, I wouldn't say crap, but definitely not the best, you know? Ooh, a guy and he's coming with more. No, no, no. Yeah, but why he put the, the... Yeah, just look. He can't finish the TC, now he will. Okay, the knights are needed. Got, got to make the third TC. The only good thing that Viper has right now is that his economy is more or less okay right now. He has Bozo, Horse Collar, not doing Will Barrow. His opponent is doing Will Barrow and forgot Bozo, but what is this? No, what are you doing? Yeah, I mean, they can help a lot against the skins, but not against the knights. I mean, it's got a kill, but yeah, the tower is there and trying to micro this against the knight. Uh oh, the TC is gonna be up, which is good, but he's doing the third TC already. Viper is still ahead in Vilius, which is very interesting according to the situation, but. Warrior Priest. He's doing more Warrior Priest. Why no Monks? I mean... 
Kai. And they are strong, but... Did the plus one? Are they okay against the knights? Actually, they do the job. And against the schemes, they might be fine. Here, I think that Armenians are S tier on land. Nah, they are not. Not for me either. Obviously, the pros are them, right? But we all can have our opinion, right? Uh oh. Okay. He's walling. Yeah. Well, it's feel that he can't really do anything. He's gonna wall this. Yes, he's walling a little bit. The middle card is in danger. Not really anymore. That TC is gone because the castle is on his face. Also, the monastery or the fortified charge will be in danger. Another TC, Siege Workshop. Four tone center. He has four TCs as well, the Viper, but he's behind in village. He has behind an army. This is game for Hera. I mean, how Hera can lose this? Honestly. Oh, this warrior priest killed the knights? What? What? I don't know, man. I really don't know. MBL! Okay, thank you for the raid. Welcome everyone from MBL channel. If you cannot chat, it's because I have the subscriber mode chat activated. Because we want to avoid spoilers from this series that was played obviously tomorrow. But I couldn't cast. Oh, he lost it. And we want to enjoy without spoil. And uh, yeah, but welcome everyone. GG guys. I mean, it, it felt at some point that the Viper couldn't do anything in this game. Honestly, you know. Says from from yesterday, not for tomorrow. I mean, tomorrow, because I always think that I can cast from the future and then I get confused sometimes, you know. <laughs> anyway, Hera with Franks, 20 skirmishes, 20 pikes, you know. And uh, look at the KD. And economy was not that much ahead, but it was going to be a lot more. And then the castle drop. I don't know. I mean, more standard approach and... Total domination by, by by Hera in this one. Game four, let's go. Okay. I will show you the the draft, guys. Let me use update. 2 1 for the Canadian already. Rocky Forest for the Canadian. I like Cyrilly Franks is better. I mean, Armenian. Eh, don't like it. I personally don't like it, you know? I will play a Nat and next game that is going to be we see the maps there and the sifts and game four is going to be oh copenhagen and now we have another well situation of civilizations what do you think they're gonna pick in copenhagen here well it looks pretty obvious right it might be bohemians and and it has to be, has to be bengalis right you know yeah. Let's go, guys. Let's go with the next game, amigos. Let's go with the next game, amigos. Okay, the Viper 1, Hera 2. We have Bohemians and Bengalis. In a map like this. 30 months left school, man. Who did 30 moons? Like, well, if you have a crazy boom here with Bengalis, you might be able to do the job, but Bohemians should be better, right? What you can do in later game without Bombard Cannon Sif in this kind of situation or map? What do you think? I mean, what do you think you can do? Like, it's kind of weird, right? Anyway, they have a dock on the left side, both. Remember that there is three relics here. You can always just knife the king, yeah, yeah. But... 
We'll see. I mean, obviously, the Bengali's boom is insane. Like, really, really insane. And maybe, if you're going to be faster than your opponent, you can get the initiative and don't let him get the, the forward position, right? Which one was the game that it was Bengalis and he got a crazy boom? It was freaking Andy against... It was freaking Andy versus Sito? It was Bengalis for Andy or was Portuguese? No, it was Portuguese, right? I don't remember. It's too many games, guys. You gotta help me. You really gotta help me. What? Okay. <laughs> was blocking the villager, man. Okay, yeah, yeah, the Ratas has been buffed, I know, but still, let's see. <laughs> Do you remember this situation to, to someone? Okay, he's going away now. He's going away. Aye, aye, aye. Well, because he sent a scout. He doesn't want to lose it. Yeah, he's going to be fine. The castle is there. All good. No snipe. He should delete maybe the walls and then... Yeah. Recover the HP. Anyway. Will... What? We borrow? Well, you got extra villages with Bohemians? No, it's with Bengalis. What he's doing with borrow? That surprised me. Blam. I don't know. He was housed? No, he's not housed. It's already 25 out of 40. Okay, he was? Okay. Okay, okay. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for the follow, guys. Welcome, everyone. Appreciate it that you join 4K chat. Insane chat. Subscriber chat, guys, today to avoid the spoiler. In general, there is no, no issues with the spoilers, but, you know, when there is some so much hype with these two guys, Viper and Hera. There's someone that is always spoiling, you know, sadly, you know. Because there's a lot of fanboys, so for you guys be able to, to enjoy. It's not that I trash all my soups, but... <laughs> okay. 2k euros. Not dollars, I think. It was euros. Okay, the galleys are here from Hera. And where's the galley from? Yeah, there's one galley only. If you do another, has to be careful. He's gonna lose the fish. Hera has lost already. Sorry, the Viper has lost already one. He's gonna lose another. Two. And. Uh oh. Yeah, Hera has a very good position. Look at the population. Obviously, he did the wheelbarrow, so he should have three villages more. 28. Still. He's four villages behind. Three fishing ships. Seven fishing ships, you know. Seven fishing ships, my goodness. Derby Tom Mayor. Thank you, man. How are we finishing the year, guys? Tomorrow is the last day of the year. And today we have one of the strongest stream of the year as well. Yeah, well, five hours already streaming. And this is only the 2-1. Game number three. Already done. This is game four. And best of seven. Now, let's see. How this is gonna finish? Remember, knock five settings. Oh, oh! Careful, really careful. He's gonna take this one. Eh, well, eh, Hera is on the way to Castle Age. I, I really don't know. You know, really don't know. You know, so so it's crazy. Who is this? Andy, thank you for the raid, man. Thank you so much. Everyone coming from Andy channel, we're casting this series. Maybe you know 
what uh, was going on. That's why we have subscriber mode chat activated. Oh my god, I thought that Andy couldn't speak, but he's soup. Damn, I can't mute this guy, man. He always can speak in the channel. Unbelievable. <laughs> Andy! I was AFK yesterday. I was going to answer you later for the message you sent me, okay? We will talk. We always talk. When are talk. you traveling to Berlin? When are you traveling to Berlin? Well, uh, that's a good question. I will travel the next Saturday. I won't be in the first day, but this strikes on a Spain, Spanish airport. With me luck, guys. With me luck. Because I might have bad luck. So let's see. Let's see. Five bellies, six bellies, eleven bellies, okay. Guys, Viper is eleven bellies behind. Yes, with Will Barrow, but eleven bell What? Is he doing... Is he doing militias? What he's doing a militia? He wanted to do a spear probably. Oh baby. To give you an idea, uh, the train from my city to Madrid to Madrid is seven hours. Did I answer already? The train from my city to Madrid is seven hours. Okay? So, yeah. From my city to Berlin, I'm not sure, you know? Uh-oh. No high-speed train? What do you think? Well, one, two tone centers, one, two tone center, also outside. 18 billion ahead because 12 fishing ships with also peace with gill nets. What the hell? Oh my god. Well, this is exactly the way you can kill with Bengalis to Bohemians, right? Check the score. Hera has a huge advantage right now. But. Viper has a militia, so it's fine. Yeah, with one militia, you are good. Right? Oh, my lord. Well, uh, he got fervor. I mean, Bohemia's economy is better than people think. But, uh... I don't know what Viper can do here to, to counter this boom. Honestly. Population difference is insane. It's true that the fish is not gonna be that efficient. Just look how far it is already. But still, he can do fish traps at some point. We'll see. Yeah, he need to take some fish. He need to take the relic. He need to do something. Really. Or is that real problem? He's now doing a dog finally. Okay. Oh, going to convert one, two, no, didn't convert anything, but we'll take that relic, that's something. Yeah, he's doing light caps, well, he has the wagons, which is stronger, but they are slow. He's doing a fire galley, he's doing a fire galley as well, he scouts at the Viper. In village numbers is the same, like two villages behind only, two, three villages. Now Pikeman upgrade. But the fish is being huge here. Oh, he's doing redemption. Interesting. Uh oh. Villier down. Yeah, that he has the loom? Yes, he does, but those lighters were strong. Delete it. You are gifting a pike. 
I don't understand this. I really don't understand. Okay, fire galley, but there's two fire galleys. Yeah, but if he comes closer, he could kill it. Send him more. Now the redemption is gonna make the job. He's not killing anything, he's losing those. Yeah, for now, just for now, Hera is just playing fantastic, this one. He's having a crazy multitasking. He's controlling the map on the left with the fish, controlling on that pond with the right, on the right, sorry, with the with the fire galleys as well. He has a fish and also now transport, so he's gonna take three relics, which is means that Hera will have five. I don't know how the Viper can come back here. We'll see. He converted now also redemption. Oh my lord. He's going to convert more or what? He convert another one. Total domination for now. 30 population more. Chemistry now for the Viper, but my goodness. He's only two bullets behind. Yes, but what's going on? He's controlling everything. Converting, killing all. My goodness, really. Anyway, light gas. Now wagons as well. Going to go back. Chemistry is on the way, so... What is the plan? Because Hera is about to go up to Imperial if he wants. Check the food he has. Not only the, the, the food he has in the bank. No, no, no. Also, a lot of villages in the queue. He could just unqueue everything and sell and go up. But let's see. Because Viper is now going to do hand cannoneers. Good luck with that. If his opponent is going to go up to Imperial. Yeah. Anyway. Viper has a lot of gold. Uh, a lot of stone as well. Maybe he could sell some resources and go Imperial. I don't know. But he's not going to do that. He's going to do hand cannoneers. I believe. Otherwise, why do you do chemistry? And three RT ranges. I have no clue. But hand cannoneers for what? To get map control? Do what? Uh-oh, two galleys. Yeah, he's converting, he's gonna lose everything. He was trying to kill the, the, the transport ship, but he can't. Obviously, he can't. Oh, man, and he's on the way to Imperial. The Viper is gonna go up to Imperial as well. This is the beauty, right, of the market. But now Bengalis has very good army, much better army than, than in my opinion, Bohemians than Bengalis, sorry. Pikes hand cannoneers. He has two hand cannoneers, the pikes are coming. The good thing with this also is that you get bomber cannons right away, 1,300 stone. Okay. And he keep booming, he's gonna send the village forward now to drop a castle. Imagine, guys, that after all this, you have 12 less more, then 14 fishing ships, 5 relics, and then you still lose the game. Do you think it's possible? What army should do now, Hera? Hmm? Yeah, he has, well, two wagons. Well, Viper has no wagons at all. Oh, man. Oh, man. Yeah, the resources are sick. But this is the brutal thing here, guys. This is the brutal thing. The Imperial time is almost the same. And having the castle for and the two C2 are shot is huge. Because now you might take the castle. Really? Okay, let's see. Oh! Light is inside. What the hell? Careful, man. He might not know he lose the king. That would be epic. Yeah, the Wild is now die against the hand cannon ears. And hand cannon here, here by Hera. Not anymore. Got it. And the castle is there. Imperial, it's two castles. Yes. But he's up. Make bomber cannons right away. Bomber cannons and trap. No? No? Okay. He's not. He could do it. And I will do another castle there, probably. He has, guys, 30 villages behind. Because remember that now. With these stone centers, 
you get right away another extra two bullets per TC. That's why the bullets numbers is crazy. It's insane, really. Yeah, Wagenburg tactics. Faster, faster siege. But that Trev is in danger. He's gonna lose it right away. Viper, Viperino. Yeah, Trev is down. This is the beauty. Oh, the hell. This is the beauty of the of the bomber cannons. Four bomber cannons. You need to defend against those light caps. Let's see Viper point of view. The lighters are coming. He's gonna wall. Nah, he has the pikes. He's gonna come with more hand cannoneers. What army is gonna do now? A uh, Hera. I don't know. He's doing a trap for now. And the monks that can convert. The Viper has now a lot of villains on gold. A lot of villains on gold. Yeah. Come on, man. Seriously? Zero villains on gold right now. Masonry. And he's gonna take this castle. We'll try. And cannoneers and pikes, you gotta be careful. He's taking the outpost. Yeah, outpost is going to be bye bye. Skirmishes as well for yellow. If you take those castles, that's the problem, man. Population is insane for Hera. Yes, but what he has? Nine light caps, nine skirmishes for monks. Army from Viper, 11 hand cannoneers, four bomber cannons, one trebuchet. What army you prefer? I know what I prefer, but you know. You know. Oh, man. Second castle down. He's gonna make a third castle at home. Yeah. Botkin Arrow is still booming and he has now 110 villages. Obviously, you have 145 villages. And what do you want? Flemish Revolution? No! It's Burgundians. Yeah, too many villages. What is he planning to do? I, I have no clue. I can't believe that Viper is gonna win this game. He might, actually. It's crazy. We'll see. Okay. Need to go back. Population 142. Hera 200 pop. 200 pop, but 160 is villages. Aldeanos, yes, Bilagers, like in the old times, well, I don't even remember how I was pronouncing those in, in the old time, but still, look at those skirmishes, he's doing now the plus three, he has more upgrades now, Viper, than his opponent, you know, we want to see reforms for what, he don't even have food, so it's better to have gold now, castle forward, but now he's coming with more army, the Viper has more army than Hera. Yes, he does. Where's the bomber cannons for his opponent? At homecoming. But the monks are there. You gotta be careful. Yeah. Oh! What is this castle? He's going crazy. What? 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 But he's coming from behind with the bomber cannons. This is crazy. So many villains. 24 villains. Now he's gonna take the traps. Taking the trail from behind like a beep. You know, and now that castle is gonna be up at the same time almost, so he's gonna take it down. This is good, man. This is really good play by the snake. Like, really, really good play, honestly. Yeah, I like it. I really like it. He's coming with light cast. He's doing now Mahayana, that is to have more population space because he wants more villains, right? Yeah, but now, take the castle, no? What? Who's too, but all the skirmishes, the king on the TC. On the town center, more and more monks converting the skirmishes. Who cares about that? I don't know. And now this, gonna mine the stone. It's 200 stone only. With the bombers, just take the castle. And that's it. Well, army here for Hera. Light caps. Use light caps and skirmishes. He has a lot of food and a lot of gold. But his army is what it is. The Viper is still with only 110 villages. I say only because his opponent got a lot more. And maybe you need more Echo. Great castle. And now take the gold. Yeah, he needs house. Or a little bit. Of, at least pikes. Pikes are coming. And now this army, if you control the bomber cannons properly, you're fine. Completely, completely, completely fine. He's doing now the halberdiers. Halves will eat the light caps. And his caves will defend properly against those. Because they have even more upgrades. You can see he's missing armor. But now the snake. Uh oh, going to convert? Nah, he won't. Halvard is there in 10 seconds. Here I still have more population. Yes, but if Viper can hold. Oh. What? Repair, man. Got the bomber cannon. Repair the castle and take the traps. I can't believe that Viper do not notice this. He's going now. Yes. 
Repair the castle. It's not repairing. It's not repairing, man. Disaster. Disaster. His focus at, at home. Population 150. Hera 180. The score is still ahead for the Canadian. Yes. But the longer the game goes... Oh, he's open there. I can't believe that he's open there. Oh, baby. Gate, gate. But it's still open, I think. No? I think it's open still. No? Okay. It's not. Plus four. Now how about this with plus four and the skirmishes with bomber cannons will dominate that army. Here, all the four is going to be lost. Okay. But here is just a spamming army. It's a spamming army with five relics as well. Is he going to make at some point, I don't know, maybe elephant archers? Well, I would love to see them. 3,000 gold for the Canadian. 3,000 gold. This helps eat the light caps. They eat them. They have 25% bonus extra against that. Against the cavalry. He's going to take the gate. Most likely, he will. Yeah, he's going aggro. He's going to wall, maybe make another gate. I don't know, forging. He has 32 army, 62. It seems that the Viper can counter her speed. Hufnische. Hufnische. Whoa. But wall it, man. No, he's going to let him wall. Uh, sorry, uh, break the walls and go in. It seems so. And he's inside, guys. The Halberdies are going to be there to defend. We'll try. Populisha is still not the best. The, the king is on dot tone center. Oh, baby. Oh, baby, baby. Ballistic now. What? All this is Kimmy's battle without ballistic. Unbelievable. Now, no plus four for Viper. He's doing Siege Engineer. How many Kovnishe? He has two bomber cannons only. Not too, not too many. You know? Not too many. But the house will deal properly. Relic. We'll take it again. He need two relics at least. Come on. Yes, he need. Chemistry too. But the game keep going. 160, 180 population. And just crazy how after 40 minutes, the army that Hera is doing with this civilization is just light caps and skirms. So then why this civilization? Because it's outboom the sieves. Well, it has to be only that explanation. This castle is about to be down. The Hovnitsche now will kill the, the traps very fast. Yeah, they will. And also the skirms as well. Yeah, just look. Whoa. Ooh. Oh, baby. Oh, really, baby. You need to protect those. Yes. Hand card now. He's gonna go... Oof. But the bomber... Sorry, the monks, guys. The monks are sick. That's for sure, you know? You can make, remember, heresy with this civilization, with Bohemians, but you need resources for that. And he doesn't have... Population, he's housed now, Viper, forever. He's gonna make houses or not? He's doing. The house and the skirms. He's gonna be able to... To hold or not? Those skins not fully braided. Those halves not fully braided. Hera has all the average right now. Even Siege Engineer. He keeps trying to push, 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 push all the time. Don't give Viper to mass to get the Bohemian's power at all. And that's why he's ahead right now. Yeah, he's not letting him breathe, which is great. He's really awesome, as you can see. Yeah. 140 villages with more than 60 army, thanks to Bengali's bonus, Mahayana. But the Viper is going to be able to, to mass army, or he's going to have to surrender. He bought it food. What? Buying food, guys. He spent 700 gold to buy food. Wow. Usually, it's the opposite. You sell to buy his taking the relic. He will. Okay, but he's still spamming. And this is what Hera is doing great here. Not giving time to the Viper. Not giving time, guys. So is Hera going to put the 3-1 here? And be closer to continuing his dominance. His real dominance in the last times. The Canadian is 3-1 winning the Viper. Is 3-1 winning the Viper. Oh, baby. Oh, man. Oh, man. Hera played this insane. Really. Really, really sick. 
how he played this one. Statistics, military, 48, 75 army. You know, 75 army, economy. Oh, oh. what is this echo, man? What is this economy, man? Oh, man. Insane, guys. Seriously insane. Game five. Let's go. Yeah, well, the, the economy, whatever is the sieve, it, it's, it, it's just what it is, right? Okay, 3-1, guys. One more game for the Canadian, and that's it. Okay. Bengalis won two Bohemians. So, what are the civilizations left, guys? Maps, Arabia, Enclosed, and Hippopotamus. Civilizations. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> well, Dravidians is great for Hippopotamus. Slavs gonna be on Enclosed, and then Viper will pick their Teutons. Mayans is gonna be Arabia. I think the Viper has better seed for Arabia. Teutons and Slavs, I think I prefer Slavs, but Viper with Teutons can play great. And then Japanese Dravidians. The start for Dravidians can be great, but Japanese should be stronger. It's close. I don't know who has better seeds remaining, you know? And it's important, right? So, game number five is going to be, guys, in close. Are we ready, guys, for game number five? And close, no YouTube stream today? No. Not I'm not doing YouTube stream today. We are here casting and I'm uploading each video on YouTube. The the, the semi-final from the from the Viper is already uploaded on YouTube. I will play an ad. And guys, we have as you can see in close Teutons Slavs. Teutons Slavs. 3-1 Hera. Okay. Well, both civilizations get crazy farm bonus. Teutons is, what, 33%? 33% bonus. And uh, Hera Slavs farms, 15% faster bonus, right? So, this emote is S tier emote. It's, it's great, right? Are you shocked? About, about having now those 3,000 viewers with recorded games. Guys, I'm sorry, really. I, I would love to have everyone chatting here. So when this series finished, please don't leave right away because I will disable the, the subscriber chat. But this is for all the viewers, not for the subscribers only. You know? You know? Let's go! Let's really go. Okay, let's see. Because the Viper now need to win all the damn games. All the damn games or his GG well play. The Viper won the first game and now Hera has come back like crazy. What do you prefer here? Slavs or Teutons? Thinking about the options for the late game, Teutons is better than Slavs. No? And Teutons has extra armor in the cavalry. Also, I think this is a good choice, Teutons. It's crazy. And the Viper usually loves to play with them. So let's see. Obviously, a Slavs and with Hera Macro and Army Control. It's pretty sick. Uh, about the map, well, usually it's the same generation. Well, same generation. You have your base that is easy, easy wallable. And then the berries, the stone, the gold is outside of that base with this rock area that cannot be wall here so it's it can be tricky this map it can be aggressive and we hope to see aggression you know yeah okay Teutons and Slavs there you go he's on the way to feudalize the Viper the snake has 19 villages Hera it's gonna go up with, oh, with the loom. Ah, this is nice then for the snake. He's ahead, same population and no loom. So 
it's gonna be quicker, gonna build faster, and it's gonna have a little bit better economy. Just a little, not big deal. Okay, happy new year, man. Hey, man, could we do some happy bettings? New year, no, bombers. it's recorded games. No bettings. You are a cheater, Mars on Fire. What the hell? My goodness, man. He want to, to, to get points, guys. Hungry's Goat converted from a prime soup to a tier one soup. Thank you, man. Thank you for the soup. Awesome. Really awesome. Cheater and addicted. Negator, did you miss me yesterday or not? Come on. Anyway, Barak. Barak as well. They are going to go scouts. I mean, this map is big. Mobility is needed. Okay. A bit is slow. Vamos, a snake. And the stable now here with two villagers. Yeah, but he's doing faster. A little bit faster. And he's still without the loom. Oh my god. He has no loom. So he has a small advantage with the echo. One a little more working for the whole time, you know? A day without mem is like a garden without. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> this negator, man. Okay, man. Anyway. I love you too, man. Um, he's sending out a scout on the spears. Chat trolling, man. I can see that. I can see that. Okay. Let's see those two spears on the scout. Well, they are doing the same. Scout and Spears. So now the micro is going to be so, so important. Viper is still without the loom. He's still without the loom. That's crazy. That's really crazy. And I'm sure that now it's on purpose. Yeah. yeah. It is on purpose. This is all wall. Probably want to make the gate here. Well, if Viper is doing now with 3-1 behind, imagine that now he's doing the bloodlines and then he has no goal to make the loom. Then I'm crying. Then I'm going to cry, you know? I'm really gonna try, gonna cry. Anyway, farms. Seven farmers. Two on the process. Wow! He's doing the loom now. No, no, no. It's not that crazy. Guys, these farms from Teuton, so cheap. 15 farmers already. While nine farmers from Hera. So obviously, the economy here is insane. And look at this. Moonwalker Scout Okay Yeah Well, population is almost the same Resources collected almost the same But this farming with Teutons is OP, man Really OP Doing the blast with here I don't like the blast with here But he's trying to hide, maybe It's better to do it there But, you know You're blocking resources here But still might do forging now, Hera? Probably. Might feel confident with his last farms. Oh, boy. Oh, really, boy. Yeah, he's with the blast with outside and he's doing forging. Inspect the attack. Yeah, the attack is, is just happening now. I like it. More aggressive. More spears and he's still... Well, both players are still spamming army. Spears as well, but more scouts from the Viper. I like that. But, guys, forging. Need to go back. No, no, no. Need to put all the spears together. He has more. Not the same spears than his opponent, but Forging is there. And the Viper is, can see Forging, and he's doing Forging himself. The gentleman! 49 months. Almost same age as Mambo. Let's go. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm 49 moons. I, I agree. Month. Month, months, month, and trollers. How many golds? 
How many villages on goal? Four villages on goal. Fourteen is here. Population is almost the same. Now Viper, sorry, here a little bit ahead. With what? With more spears than his opponent. What? Militias? It's a mistake. It's a misclick for sure. Let's see if he's gonna notice because he's quite resources and they're bad in this approach. Yeah, he cancel and doing spears. Good, 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 good. Palisade gate maybe here? Nope. Okay. But he's sending now scouts to raid. Four bullets on goal are safe and the berries are exposed. That's why he's not even taking a single bullet there. I mean, ooh. Yeah, the Viper is just going very aggressive. I like it. He's doing the bloodlines. He filled that 23 farmers, but now 20 farmers. The good thing is that he has all these farms for so long, longer ago. And now Hera can see the scouts here. This is with forging. Bloodline is going to be there in a moment. He need to kill now the village on the goal. Yeah. And you're going to kill with the bloodlines. You can kill this. Yeah, it's forging. And now those villages are going to go down. You never know when you are done. Exactly like your mods. Oh man. Oh man. <laughs> Thank you for the for the soup. Don't troll my mods. They, 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 are, they are nice people. Terrible doing the mod job, but they're great. Oh, oh, look at those. No, no. It's taking what? One valley only. But now Bloodlines and Forging. You need to kill more. He's gonna kill it or not. He's attacking also here. And now Viper need to multitask a little bit better here. Villiers down, okay. So at the end, it's 3-1 in Villiers, you know? 3-1 in Villiers. You gotta be careful, gonna take another. All right, and there you go, be careful. Oh, vamos, the gentleman. Thank you so much. Oh, the piñita got a soup, nice. But here are resources. Sarah, here are resources. It's about to click up, man. Well, Viper is not too far, but. Ooh, it's five villages kill. Then, Bloodless and Forging is worth the investment, guys. Well, if Viper is up quicker, ouch. Mm, it's gonna go up. It's four villages ahead. I think it's worth it. Right? Is up. 15 seconds difference. I think it's good. I mean, four villages more is solid. It is very solid. It's quite some resources more than Viper can take now. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Nice walls here. Look at the spear now. Very good play by the, by the snake there. The spears are defending. But the lay down. Huh? He will kill that villain. Not good. 5 2 now. He's raining less. One more time. But he's here with more scouts. And. Uh oh. No, no, no. Oh, that villain is in danger. Look. He's chasing for that villain. He's chasing for the blood. He's going back with that one. I like it. He's going home now with those resources. Uh, checking resources in the bank right now. It looks better for the snake. But here I slaps economy will explode also too so should be okay for both 80 moons 80 moons all right thank you so much for the 80 moons scale bar and armor you gotta be careful three spears Moving around. Now look at those. Yeah, he's gonna be able to do two extra TCs at Monastery. With that economy? Pff, anything he can do, man. Yeah. Pikeman upgrade. Alright. Pikeman upgrade. Okay. Pretty sick. Okay. At the bother, thank you for the for the for the new followers and everything, guys. Come on! Thank you so much. And now the Prime. Ooh. You gotta be careful. Hype train. Let's go. Uh-oh. Nah, the pipe will deal. It might kill a villager, probably. He's gonna save it? No. This Viper is weak. Yeah, yeah. If he's losing another villager, it's... What? Who is this Viper? It's a Smurf. It's a Smurf. Three TCs, guys. 
Three TCs and now he's gonna lose another. Oh my lord. Well, he's doing the second TC. At the end, 5-4 village kill, so still so close. Monastery, he did Bozo, Will Barrow. Great, you know, really, really great. Swindy, Swind Windy, thank you for the prime. And now Lara Ep, thank you for the tire subscriber, man. For the tire one subscriber, awesome. Uh oh. And thank you, the new follower, man. I can't check the name, but the Viper need to attack. He has a lot of army now. Eight pikes, eight knights, no army, only light caps. No, 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 the light caps shouldn't be a note. He has the TCs already. Yeah, the light caps, I mean, you don't have husbandry. That's why probably pikes are needed. You cannot go only with cavalry, right? Population is very similar to, to the Viper. For yeah, for both Viper and, and Hera. Yeah, but they still have the army numbers. I think the position is better for the Snake, not only for the army. The three TCs already. And he's Teutons. He's trying to kill. And... Oh! Yeah, he convert, but he's killing. That's crazy. Okay, and the Pikes. Remember, extra armor, extra melee armor. But this is what matters with the fights they are doing. Thank you for the follow. Viper has a lot of wood. A lot of, a lot of wood. He needs to spam farms right now. Spam a lot more farms and quick. He can see this. Yes, he can. Oh, he's gonna break it. Nope, maybe he can now with those knights. It's so many. Nah, it's wall. Is well completely. Hera is taking the lead. Look at the population. Good thing for the Viper. Taking relics. That's good. It's not taking relics now. Oh. Yeah, like, you got husbandry. He has husbandry. Well, no husbandry for for the Viper. But now with Teuton having devotion and uh, the armor, the extra armor, you see? Two plus one. Two plus two. That's pretty solid. Sending the pikes, trying to kill the monk. He's gonna be able. Mm -hmm. It's Teuton's bonus. He's gonna be able to kill or not? Oh my god, he didn't convert. He didn't convert. So now he's gonna kill the monk. He can't kill it or not? Oh my god, crazy. He got it. He got it. That's good, man. That's really good. But need to go away. Army, more army from Hera. He's now doing the plus one armor. Villa's number better for the Viper. Normal three TCs for a longer time. And now he's starting to make more stables. He's going to spam army for every 40 farmers now. That's a lot of farms. That's uh, already a lot of farms. Of course, uh, Slavs has 29 and with the farm bonus. But double barrack on the right, double stable on the left. He's going to spam army. Uh-oh. Chain bar in armor. And he's going all military in Castle Age. Score is switching. Population is the same. The cities are... Well, the games are very close. But uh, it's 3-1 for Hera. So... The Viper need to win this. And then we can say, oh, it's a close series. Because if not, he's dead. You know? But I think this is looking good for the Snake. Like, Hera has more army, yes. But Light Guys are... I think they are now a little bit useless. And I prefer the Viper army. Why? Well, because he's stronger first, and second, he has also the upgrades with the chain barden armor. So those knights are very tanky. Two plus three melee armor, sick, oh, very sick. Yeah. Oh my God, hungry is goat. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Really appreciate it. Five subscribers give. The hype train keep going. Vamos. Remember, guys, that 25% discount is still there for subscriptions. Yeah. I forgot to mention, sorry, I'm su super terrible with the sellout, but it is still till 2 of January, if I'm not mistaken. Uh oh, careful. Handhard. That's sick. Let's go. 
That's really sick. Iwathal, thank you, man, for the 23 moons. Yeah, population is still growing for the Viper. Plus two armor. I like that he's not being greedy. But guys, Hera is going to drop a castle, probably. And when you see this, what Hera will do? Maybe Pike's a lone swordsman? Mm. Maybe. No, the Viper will have crazy economy. No, he has already. He's close to 50 farmers with handcart. Handcart? No, nah. It's similar, man. Like, Hera has also crazy farming as well. Look at this. In this area, 26 farmers only there. That's crazy. But what I like it the most for the Viper is the amount of farming he has. It's insane. Now, 40 army with the upgrades, plus two, plus two. They're sick, you know? Woo -woo. Yeah, they're sick. And also extra melee armor too. Zero plus three. So it's not only for the cavalry, it's also for the infantry. We forget about that. And now Hera has zero bellies on gold, guys. Zero bellies on gold. Happy New Year, Mambrillo. Thank you, guys. Happy New Year for everyone. Yes, it's tomorrow the last, the last day, guys. Oh, this is great. Yeah, Viper is being very, very aggressive. He's helping a lot in this one. Yeah, this is the, 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 the key in these matchups. And if you play against Hera, you have to play aggro. Honestly. In a defensive approach, Hera wins. Because I think in the defensive approach, he might be the number one right now. Yeah. Uh, with his macro and his uh, speed, you need to be very aggressive. This is what Viper is doing now. His population is absolutely insane right now. Check the resources for the snake. He need to drop a castle here on the hill. Obviously, if you go farther, it's better, but you know, it's more tricky. Yeah, but on the hill is good, you know? He's missing nine stone. He's on the way to Imperial, and the castle for Hera is on the right. Oh, who is this Viper, man? On his face. Literally on his face, but why only three bellies, guys? It doesn't make sense, only three bellies, you know. Imagine that he was coming now with millions of military. Anyway, guys, the snake. Want to extend this series to game number six. And he's going on the way to do it. Because his population is great and he's also up to Imperial. So, slabs are not broken. If you play properly with them, it's beatable. It seems like this. 52 farmers, 11 on goal. He has three relics already. And the most important, 40 pikes. 40 pikes. What the hell? He's now raiding with knights. He's walling. Okay. But his population is on point right now. The castle will be up. More villages. And well, uh, Hera has not clicked it up yet. Yeah, he, he can't. He has no resources. Now the pikes are coming. And the Magonal is going to start to kill villages. There you go, man. Oh, man. Okay. He's now moving. But look at the amount of pikes. He's going really, truly aggressive. Holy moly. Yeah, well. The pikes are plus two, plus two for both players. But obviously the Teuton spikes will be better. Because of the extra armor. And look at this. Oh my god. Lot of pet. New subscriber and gifted soups. What the hell? Thank you, man. At the end, everyone in the stream will be able to talk in the chat. Apologize for the subscriber chat, but it's for you guys. I mean, if you cannot speak in the channel, it's just to enjoy more. GG called the Viper did an amazing game. And Hera didn't even click up. He dominated. Why the Viper doesn't play all the time this aggressive? Well, because all the civilizations are different. And mamma mia, amigos, game number six will happen. Oh boy, oh really boy. He used Teutons, in my opinion, great. Really, really, really great. Yes. 109, 93, 62, 42, 20 population difference. In military is a lot. But the economy, when you are fighting against slabs and you get almost 2,000 more, well, it's 1,000 more food, but would also a little bit ahead. Go a lot more. Something you'd have done really well with the same values. And what he did well was the aggression. Game six. My goodness. My goodness. All right. All right, all right. Game number six. Well, 
let's check guys the draft and uh, update the draft because in closes for the viper teutons and slavs the score three two and i'm gonna play a nat just to don't have that in between the games arabia and hippopotamos obviously Heras will pick hippopotamos and civilizations mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. civilizations what can be in civilizations there dravidians and japanese has to be dravidians and japanese has to be yeah i think so okay let's go guys let's go let's really go guys vamos amigos okay are you ready let's go guys vamos okay we have sell out map <laughs> for knack five and for nelly right the viper japanese Hera, Dravidians. All right. All right, all right. <clears throat> Dravidians is very strong in the start, but if you don't make early damage, Japan, anytime. Anytime. Obviously, doing damage to Japanese on water with the fishing ship tanky, it is difficult. So. If the Viper hold the, let's say, the early aggression, I prefer the Viper civilization, you know? I don't know what you think, guys. You gotta tell me. Thank you for the follow, guys. Hopefully you enjoy. I believe you do. And please, when this series finish, nobody leave the channel. Let, let's talk uh, about the series and about everything, you know? I mean, nobody leave. Wait a little bit, you know? Because I want to talk with all the viewers that are there. It's a special time. We are about to finish the 2023 and it's a good moment to have even questions and answers and everything, you know. But Viper and Hera fighting, well, like the whole year, right? At the end of the year for another big, 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 big matchup, right? Yeah, the Viper with Japanese dock already, so a little bit faster. Well, that's normal. You get a lumber camp that is cheaper 50% both did finally the lumber camp here not going for these areas remember that many players are doing this <clears throat> and I hope they are not gonna go a lot on water we saw in the semi-final how one of the players played against her and did three dogs guys wow never saw this before in a map like this that is super open in the land right yeah, this man looks like a panda. Level six hype train. Vamos! Thirty seconds to to to, to go for the level seven. I I I. Unbelievable. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. He's gonna make the loom now, and then after the loom can go up. So really, nineteen twenty of the layers. I think he might. Thank you for the follow. Awesome. Okay. Both are doing the loom at the same time, so they are going to go up pretty much the same time as well. Two bullies and two two fishing ships. Two bullies and two fishing ships. Doing now the third. Already. Great. And that's my daughter telling you thank you for joining the channel. Awesome. Beautiful. Nice. Okay. What are they going to do now? Because really don't know what are they going to do. Hey, this is the barrack now. Ooh. Right? Thank you, more followers. Vamos, amigos. Let's reach 3,000 viewers for the end of the of the stream. Call everyone. Call your family. Bring your doggy. Your doggy has an account on Twitch. Create it. 
Okay. Anyway, as you can see, Hera is well completely this area, which is nice. It's definitely very nice. He has a second dock at the back. And the Viper has a barrack. He's doing malicious. I like it. You see now the barrack? Well, no barrack here. Obviously, you have good, very nice wood. Thanks to the Dravidian's bonus. He's going galleys. And now he's doing the barrack. He's sending only... Happy holidays. Oh, it's three militias. He's coming here with the other two. Thank you, Josh. Appreciate it, man. Thank you for the prime. Men at arms. Oh, man. Those men at arms are insanely good. They are Japanese one. I'm going to check now. Hera is just waiting. Uh, no, he's going for the wood. Ah, like it. I'm going to see now Hera's reaction. He's not expecting those, maybe. And his reaction? He didn't react yet. Now he knows that he's getting attacked. He's trying to use four, and that is a billion down. Yeah, those Japanese are so strong. Ooh! Oh, why not? Yeah, but he could kill that villager. Anyway, oh my god, another villager down. Two villagers down, guys. 31 population, 28. Yeah, he has no answer. It's what? Stable. Okay. I mean, I'm surprised about the stable. Do you make one spear now? And, and, and those many times eat the scouts. Yeah, the Minotaurs are super worthy right now, for sure. Population 34, 30. Village number 4, village ahead. 3 villages killed. 3 villages. Come on. He's gonna do now the armor in those Minotaurs or what? Uh... No, I'm a stupid. He has the archery range already. He's gonna go fletching. I didn't notice he has the archery range already. Wow. He has a very important advantage, honestly. He's gonna prepare that. Now he's gonna take the scout. He got it. He need to micro. He's gonna make a demo. He need to repair that one. Oh man, he's repairing both now. Ay, 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 it's two villains. He's gonna repair for sure. He has to be careful. No, he's repairing this one, but no. And now he need to go away to do lose that villager. Hera is doing a great job on the fish. No, the snake fail. <laughs> He failed! He lost out two villages here. The man at times still taking another villager because he got four. I miss it where. He's coming with the skirms. Fletching already gone. And he's gonna take it. No, that's the... Oh! Viper, move it! There's a demo. And he's focusing more on water. He's gonna take it. He has to be careful. He has nothing there to defend. The scouts... In danger. Hera is adapting really well to the situation, to the early damage. Let's see if the Viper gonna notice. Oh, the Viper didn't really, and now he did. And the fish? Ooh. Ooh. He's going back. Yeah, that's a good move. That's a really good move. Come to the galley. This is really low HP, and we'll take it. And that demo? He was coming to the shore fish. Yeah, but he's gone. And now the archers are on the goal with Fletching. He's doing now the archery range. This is not good for, for Hera. This is not good for Hera. Put him away from goal. He's huge here. Massive right now. 44 population, 39. Yeah, too much on water. Might be... Oh. Might be very tricky, actually. Kill the other. And he put in front. He's bringing the demo. But water is going to be gone. And it's important. I mean, taking... The water for the Japanese is so, so big, actually. Look at Hera population getting closer. Bad thing is that Hera has no gold, but check his resources. Check his resources. Oh, man. Oh, man. It really looks like the game number seven is unlikely to happen. Population is still ahead for... Okay, that demo is not worthy against one spear. All right, but he took damage. It looks like the game number seven is unlikely to happen, guys. I want it against seven. It's always super exciting, but I don't know, man. He's up to Castellage. It's true that 
on the land doesn't have anything that it's it's really scary but viper is not close to go out so i don't know i really don't know it's good food here in the corner still really no fish he's doing a fire galley okay hey, it's only two fishing ships so why that match oh forging what forging for what for the spears uh, okay it's stable it's gonna go full feudal now well honestly if there's a civilization that you can do that maybe it's against dravidians even more if he doesn't have crossbows his scouts and skirms can kill dravidians castle each army because what he has right now his scouts and skirms himself without bloodlines right so let's see let's see I don't know, but looks definitely bad. Here is now taking the score lead. Bozo, you gotta be careful. If you kill the scout, the scouts are now gonna kill also the skirmishers. He need to go. Yeah, and he will kill. Bozo and not doing any upgrade. He's doing TCs. Yeah, well. Doing a tower here to defend the gold, but... He definitely has a, a awkward approach here, uh, Hera. Because this is what it is, Dravidian, right? Now he could switch into into crossbows or go siege, maybe. But his economy is not the greatest. That's why he is going for, for a TC. Seven villages on gold. Where is his mining gold? Oh, he's coming now? What? Uh, where is mining gold? Uh, da, 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 da. Oh, he's here. All right. I couldn't see the, the, the yellow because if you check the minimap, you only see the blue dot. Okay, the Viper is on the way to Castleage, doing another archery range. Ooh, I smell cab archers. Yeah, but he can do skirms and they are shooting faster. I don't know. Okay. He might have a demo here, but he didn't. Another villager down. Yes, another villager down. And another one. Bam. It's down. The scout's gonna take now those skirmishes. This is really good. That he can kill those that army is really good. He's still going with Botkin. Okay, but he's holding well. Bloodlines. And now, oh. Take the fish also. What the hell? You see how weird these Dravidians, guys? It's true that he went up to castle, but now he has not the greatest economy. Five on foot, 19 on foot. Okay. It's looking better now for the snake. Look at the army numbers. He did a tower also. Nine army. He is ahead in Valise. All right. No galleys. No galleys at all. It's not creating more arches and skims, guys. So he's going cap arches, guys. But he's mining a lot of stone. Japanese now is better, man. He can go knights. He can do monks. He can go army that Dravidians can't really counter. Yeah, I like that he's mining a lot of stone, so he maybe want to drop a castle here, right? Okay, he's doing knights. He has double his table. Ooh! Balaboom! Take those skirmishes. Yes! He didn't, couldn't kill all those. But he took now the skirmishes. No army, man. Two skirmishes and four galleys. Uh, no army, man. Yeah? Well, he's now doing the market. He's gonna drop a castle. Uh, it, it what he can. For real? For real? Amazing trap! My goodness! Okay. Husbandry. Will borrow the trap in the hell, man. Yeah. But actually, he can't really kill those. Well, with Botkins, he can. So annoying, man. He's killing those with with that army. Sick. Hera heading population, heading village, similar army. The knights are coming. He's now doing monks. War galley upgrade. But the knights are there, and he see it. So, he's gonna trap? He asked. No, he didn't trap. It's not Asko. It's good. Oh! What? Okay, he took a villain for a night. Eh. Not the best. 
and not the worst. Stone, 500 stone. Stone, 700 stone. Who is winning this game? Well, it was looking that the Viper was going to be in a head position now, but I'm not sure anymore. Hera has a good boom. A very nice one. Uh oh. Delete it? Nope. Oh! He didn't delete it, man. And then he converted. Not great for the snake. But this is what usually Dravidians struggle a lot. Siege Monk's Knights. How do you counter that? Well, you can defend with a castle, but you defend with a castle one spot, but no the mobility, right? So let's see what's gonna happen. Population is still exploding. More boom. More boom for the Canadian. Another TC. Viper is also booming too. Mangonel. Castle here for, for Hera? For example? No? Yeah, he has monks and siege. Archie ranged. Archers and skirms. <coughs> Hera is basically booming right now with not many army. Crazy amount of stone, which is not using. The Viper can drop a castle also. And he's coming, guys. Oh, my lord. He's coming with a castle. He's going to make a castle here. Take the farms or juice on the wood. I think here is great. Yes, man. You see, guys, I know something. I know something. It's great here because you take all the farms. That's fantastic. He has farms. He has farms here, Viper, at the back. He's doing the castle, but he can see the problem is that the mangonel is there. And with the mangonel, you can drop the castle. Yes, do defend now, but the castle get what he want. And it's, oh, not only that, it's, oh, kill villains, man. If he's breaking in, this castle is not up. He's going, oh, oh, well, there's a monk, but, 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 might kill villains. The mangonel is coming, go, go with the mangonel, Mel. The monk is down, he converted, but just kill more villains. And then his economy is suffering, but they still have a head in villains even after this. Oh, it's a doubt castle. What the hell? He's killing a lot. No, he's gonna make it, but so many villains kill. Echo KD 27. What? Take the villains number 5367 game number seven to happen. Ay ay ay. He killed it a lot. Huge amount. 38 and he's still killing. And it's Dravidians, guys. I mean, Dravidian has a good transition, a good start. Yes. A good start, not a good transition. But the transition after, well, you know, it's, you know. Guys, we have almost 3,000 viewers. If we get 3,000 viewers with recorded games, I keep streaming. Huh? And the Viper is on the way to Imperial. It's on the way to Imperial, man. 24 hour stream? Mm, okay. Sounds good to me. Hungry is gold. What happened, man? Oh my god, everyone is gonna be able to talk at the end. Am I, guys, that you. Well. I know. I was going to. You would say. I, I will tell you later. Something came to my mind. Anyway, guys. Um, that's insane. That Hera is still ahead in population. Now Viper has no army. But in a map like this, oh, he's on the shit. way to Imperial. Beno, thank you for the gift. It was over 3k earlier, right? Yes. And it's gonna be even more now for a potential decider. My goodness. My real goodness. Well, it was looking so good for Hera, but these maps are also very tricky and specific. And the gameplay, you know, anything can happen with these players, you know. Anything really can happen. But uh, I don't see any way that now Hera can come back. He's not even close to go up. He has the castle so, so close. You, you get with the threat, take the castle. I think Hera will resign when he sees that his opponent is in Imperial. You know? Yeah. I think so. I really think so. Look at those. Double RC range. Uh oh. Careful. Careful. Might lose those. Yep. But the Mangonel. Uh, he got Ballistic even. Yeah, he's gonna lose more. He's gonna go close to, to the castle. 
He need ballistic himself. He's not doing. Oh, the knight is gonna be taking the magro, or maybe not. Okay, he deleted, man. Anyway, let's see her reaction in nine seconds. Let's see her reaction in two seconds now. He's in Imperial Age, he's still going, he has more population, but how you counter now? The plus three on the traps. Well, he has a good boom, actually. Gonna make the mail. And his resources are great. You can have bomber cannons with Dravidians, so that matters, but you can make great monks with, with Japanese. The problem is the timing, the momentum. Like, he's on the way to Imperial now, but the Trebuchets are coming. He won't be able to defend this castle. And then, he can go right now in the north or not. Yes, he can. The least skirmishes. Not plus three, though. He has no resources. He will do now the plus three. Yeah, he's doing, guys. And the plus three is sick. It is really sick. The castle will be down. And, uh, well, here is up to Imperial Age. It's crazy, guys. For me, it's absolutely crazy that Hera... After losing 40 villages, he's ahead in villages than the Viper. How the hell is possible? When Viper has also four TCs. Like, I mean, I know that the other TC for Viper is bigger, but it's crazy, man. Like, like honestly. Okay. It's doing another castle in the north. The score is still so close. Are you kidding me, man? Is... Is Hera able to... To keep in this game, population is the same almost. It's almost the same. Yeah, he has no more stone. Careful there. Thank you for the bits, man. Rebusy will take that castle. Remember that you can do also hand cannon use with Japan. He trapped again the army, man. I mean, seriously? What's going on? It's not this important because the trap is there, but man, what the hell? My goodness, the snake. Yeah, one relic that is gonna take it. I mean, the Viper is at the limit. The score is almost the same. And now he's gonna make plus three, but he should do probably even better chemistry, if you ask me. Population now better for the Viper. Villa is the same, but army double. Double the army. That's really important. Like, really, really important. Skimmers is here, here now. Taking the gold miners as well. It's true that he has expanded quite a lot. Oh, God. Look at this. What? He's not even attacking. Come on, Hera. Now, light caps. Yeah. He has a good echo now. And uh, Skimmers is a light gas. It's gonna be probably the end. He's doing more towers. Okay. Another TC. More villains for Hera, man. Seriously. Parthian tactics. Light caps. Moving around. And with another trap. Yeah, he's doing another TC here. Wow, Hera is trying to expand. Since the map is huge, it's immense, he can't do it. But the problem is the same in the whole game. Mobility. What Dravidians can do as army? Because, yeah, he's booming back, but he's still not doing army. He has nine skirmishes and one trap. And if he's coming now with this trebuchet and all this army, he's going to take it, guys. He's definitely going to take it. Yeah, more TCs, okay. Viper just need a little bit more farms and then able to raid more. Mining goal and well, he's gonna see that he's there and then you can raid more. Finally, chemistry, but he has no armor. Uh, basically, he has all these skirmishes, but not a braided, not fully braided. And Viper has thirty-one skirms. It's like triple the skirms. So. The Viper keep going. The Snake is gonna force game number seven, guys. I mean, how can Hera come back here? He's attacking all over. Yes, he's moving all over. Well, in the Outcrap map, it was similar situation, right? Oh. 
Sticking out the relics. But these completely different sifts. Completely different sifts. Three trebuchets, skirmishes, population is still growing and growing. And if he takes this castle, and he will take this castle, well, he's coming with bomber cannons. Okay, bomber cannons is an extra life that Hera has. No farmers, but the bomber cannons can take the traps. Is the Viper gonna notice? Let's see. Bomber cannon in the north. Let's see the snake. He should kill the trap. Yes, and probably the mangonel even faster. He take it with those. And now? Oh, baby. Oh, baby, the bomber cannon. It's so important. And the trebuchets are going to be down. The bomber cannons are huge. Look at the score. Yes, Hera is still going, guys. 140 population, 164. Now Bozo, not the best upgrades here. Now for the Viper, he should have done before. And now some raiding, some light caps as well. Moving all over, look at the castle here. He did the castle again here on the left with one trebuchet too. And Hera is still holding. How? I don't know. But he's still doing it. Yeah, the Viper is doing now more light caps. They are not fully upgraded because they don't have also the plus four armor. Available for Japan. Two castles. Population is still at the limit for Hera. But if he must bombard cannons, and now he has two. Oh boy. Oh really boy. He might need at some point pikes. But the good thing is that he is still taking more and more bullets. Yeah, this is good. Yeah, not letting him take the stone. TC down. Cab archers. He bought the stone. And now Hera is gonna buy. He's gonna put another castle. Where? Uh, I don't know. He has expanded all over. It's a huge, massive map, guys. More light caps. Hand card. Already. And now the light caps might do the damage. Yeah, but the population eh, seems to be getting closer. Slowly. As you can see, no, 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 this is so important. Don't lose the bomber cannons. I don't think he will lose against those skirmishers. Okay. He's trying to come forward to kill, but the light guys are being annoying. Still, he's okay. What army he should do? Maybe pikes. Population is, military is getting closer and closer every second. Oh, ballistic now. Unbelievable. Ballistic. Ballistic. So a ballistic long time ago, probably. Anyway, the two traps and the two bomber cannons. The game is getting so, so damn intense. Because we thought that it was going to be a uh, decided, but now I'm not sure anymore. Even more with this Hera that is crazy. Crazy player, you know? Yeah, 1,300 stone. Obviously, you need more farms. He's doing another TC. I like it. But what army you do? Well... If he's still going with bomber cannons and scams and few pikes, the army from uh, armies, uh, Viper's army is not as scary. I don't know what you think. I mean, yeah, few light guns and skirmishes. That's it. Yeah, and the monk in the hell doing towers now. Oh, baby. Again, okay, trebuchet and bomber cannons towers. All right, not the best, but still. The light guns are idle. Send it. All the light guys here, and he has nothing to defend. Only a few archers. The light guys are now where? I don't know. I don't see them anymore. He's raiding here. Taking a tower. He's coming with a, one trap, Mr. Viper. Yes. And he took all this area. He still has more map control, but are you going to be able to kill this? I believe he will. He's 200 population. Hera, 160. But he's doing already Arvales. Arvales is going to be very dangerous. Very dangerous, and he's coming with bomber cannons with traps, skims, and few arbalists as well. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, ay, ay. The score is getting closer, as you can see. Well, he's raiding. Oof. He raided a lot here. Raided a lot, but now he's a lot of light caps. Yes, but those arbalists might kill the light caps. They are not great light caps. Definitely not, but if you kill the bomber cannons, it's huge. Sticking one or not? One down. Now, nah, but that army died. Now. 5947 and Hera is still coming. Where's the skirmishes now from Viper? I have no clue. On the right side, he wants to take the TCs. Ooh, don't lose the traps with Phillies, man. 
He's going back. Skimmers is out there, but... Going back with the traps. In this area, it's getting now rated unbelievable that the game keep going, seriously, and that Hera can still alive in this game. It's crazy. It's crazy. Seriously. Oh, demo. Nah. It's too far, right? But he took the trap. He took the trap. Difficult to kill this army. Army numbers very similar. But his economy is at the limit. 100 villages is not an oath. It's gonna come with more. The relics are gone now for the Viper. He's sending few light caps just to, 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 to death. And the demo? What? The demo doesn't reach anything. Anyway, he's still raiding. Crazy. Coming with the traps and skirmishes as well. So at the same time that he's getting attacked, he's trying to take more and more echo from his opponent. No! He has a bomber cannon. Oh my lord. Okay. And finally the Viper is here with the scams and doing a great upgrade that he needs to do it. Cataparuto. Those trebuchets are like bomber cannons now with the speed they have to shoot. But army numbers is almost the same. Hera is now housed. He need to, to make more houses and fast. This is really good. This is really good. And if you take the trap now, poof, at the limit, guys. At the limit. Both flyers, really. But the Viper Soul is still forced. What? Cannon Galleon in this game? I don't see this. We don't see this too often. Four trebuchets. 200 population, 160 is still housed forever. Come on. He killed all this. And now Hera has nothing. Like, only. He's only here. 70% of the map for the Viper guys is look likes, right? Guard Tower, Jasama Towers, and. Uh, wow, it took so long to finish this game for the Snake. But it's normal. Hera is trying 100%. Look at those cannon galleons. Arrow lights. So, all the upgrades. Uh oh. He's gonna shoot. Oh. Okay. He's not shooting. He's going around. Still crazy. Hera population, guys. I mean, with so little map he has, his population is still insane. He's the same population almost at the Viper, really. What the hell? He can't really take those units, but with the traps, he will take the castle. It's the good thing. Demos is coming. A demo is coming. Ooh. No, didn't kill anything. But the castle is down. Another traps will be down with the bomber cannons. At least the castle is down. Look how fast he unpack those trebuchets. He's gonna move back or not? Just move, man, or you will lose them all. But now Viper still have a lot of a lot of skirmishes. Galleons, guys, galleons in this game. Crazy. It's still almost 200 population. He's doing another castle again. And Hera keep going. Hera keep going. Forever and ever. Yeah, and galleons. This is the warrior attitude, right? The scores still say that Viper is ahead, but both are 200 population. 200 population. My goodness. All right, look at those light caps. Gonna push those and the arbalest. What the hell? Pretty sick, guys. Pretty sick. Double the army, guys. Now for the Viper. Crazy resources. Even if he's doing fast fire ship. How many villains on gold got here right now, guys? This is the, the big issue here. How many villains on gold for the Canadian? Please, can you spam in the chat? Are you able to do it? Vamos. Vamos! Zero, guys. And that's obviously something that won't let him go for a long time. Let's see, guys, because I need to go to the toilet! Vamos! Is this game finished or not? Ay, ay, ay. Well, the game is crazy. And it's crazy that Hera is still in the game, you know? <laughs> Well, the fast fires are so good. They take the galleons. Yeah, but you don't have any gold. But honestly, 
with the army that he see from from the viper he feel like stops incredible game incredible caster less than three thank you man like he feel like well with the skirmishes i can be fine my schemes are better and it's not like viper has an insane army it's skirmishes as well it's true that he's getting galleons and so on so the longer the games goes and thanks to all the economy he has advantage he should be able to take it but he's doing what and all the castle here yeah well but he has galleons so i mean if he's doing a castle to defend it's just not possible right no 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 he's repairing this castle galleons here the try hard is real for both right it's really real score difference still is still crazy 200 population heavy demo whoa okay we might see some more by the boom or what yeah, but yes, he he's cornered completely. He's completely cornered now. Oh, oh that wasn't great for Hera. Because he's going to have the upgrade now. And he has no demos anymore. Yeah, just one. He's going to make more towers. His cameras, light caps. He's still, he's still with a great population. And I don't know how, honestly. Fast fire ships as well. You can see how... How great are the bomber cannons? Without Siege Engineer, and he's kind of holding thanks to those units. You know? I mean, not only that, but you know what I mean. They they really push it back. But now, the lightcaps are here. So many lightcaps. Gonna take the bomber cannon. Gonna take the trap. It's coming with the skirms. Hera has more army than Viper, guys. It's true that it's all skirms. 50 skirms. But that shouldn't be a note now. Well, I don't know, man. I really don't know. Still. Doing towers now. Resources are crazy. Are crazy resources for the Viper. He has everything. All the map. And well, the map control gave him definitely the, the game. Also, the civilization in late game. Now, Japanese is just much better. Look how he's selling wood and food to get gold. Desesperate gold. Fast fire ships. You know, he has one trap. And Suki won't have wood, right? Look at the heavy demo. These towers are going to be epic now. Keep tower. Yeah, and Hera, keep, keep going. Yeah, those towers are epic. One trebuchet that is going to be down with the Kataparuto trebuchets. And guys, we want to see... The game number seven, because I believe that this is impossible for Hera to come back because he has no map and no resources. He's doing the stables now, light caps, 57 farmers in no space. It's crazy. How he locate all those, I don't even know. You know, and if he puts some towers on the wood line, he won't have any wood to take. Yeah, one tower here, one tower there, and, and that's it. Anyway, still with great population. Hera, but that should drop now. Oh, 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 yeah, yeah, those demos. Bam. Yeah, but it's too many units now. Too many. Too many units now. It's dropping now. Population 166, 180. Where's the trebuchets? I don't even know where the trebuchets are. Sorry, go. More towers. He's the guy. Made a pause. You know? Trebuchet coming. You're gonna take the bomber cannon. Population is starting to drop dramatically. And is the snake going to finish this game? Because the score now is getting closer. What is this? Population is still the same. It's, it's coming back. It's impossible, right? 3,200 gold while Hera has zero gold for the last... I don't know. 30 minutes? 30 minutes for sure. Yeah. That's insane. Really. Really insane. Yeah, he could do whatever. Lead Samurai or whatever he want. And those traps? Uh-oh. Well, he could do monks if he wanted to convert the bomber cannons. But the bomber cannon is killing the traps, guys. Oh, my God. He's going... Oh. <laughs> okay. Bomber cannon. Bam! Trebuchet down. It's still... 
almost the same population. Score is not even dropping. Oh my lord. Tre uh, Tower here coming with more, more demos. He's just using the market to stay in the game. Unbelievable. Really? Make him a boom. What? That was a mistake. But uh, still. I'm a speechless. He's more population than Viper. Obviously, he's struggling. The KD is even better for Hera. Not the Echo KD for sure. No more towers. And well. Yeah. 900 score difference. This is stabilized there. And he won't have wood, guys. This is the only wood left. Well, he still have wood. Ah, so he's taking here too. Why well, he's not doing a tower? Because he's losing with the traps. That's, that's insane, man. Seriously insane. Okay. Still have more army. The castle is gonna go down with the elite cannon galleon. No, it's cannon galleons, not elite. More towers. Okay. Over 3,000 gold. I think Viper could do better army, right? Than just skims and light camps. Like... Whatever, you know? Someone say the least summer as well. He has one castle only. Cab archers. Heavy cab archers against Kerms. Why not Onegas and Halts, for example? He's doing just Skirms and and light caps, and the light caps are really weak. Because Cab Arches with the Skims, he's gonna be okay. Well, if he has Light guys and Cap Arches, he's not gonna be okay. Anyway, guys, he's still 190, no, 200 population. Hera is still 200 population. How? Only he knows. And what? He escaped from that area? He's gonna go attack now to, through the middle? Are you kidding me, right? Yeah, man. Yeah, well. He's gonna take this gold. 600 gold. Just send villages and take it. Why not? It's something. He's gonna try to raid now. Crazy resources. But... Same army for both players. It's now coming with more towers, skirmishes to kill more villages. And now, he will kill a lot here, I believe. No? I mean, many villages now. Trebuchet to take this tower. Oh, baby. Skirmishes are coming. Look at the galleys. Another tower, more skirmishers. And where's his army? He has 25 light caps. Now he's coming. The light caps will do the job here. Yes, they should. It's only skirms, no pikes, no anything. More army for the Viper, a lot more army. If you clean this army, it should be the game. Or not. Well. Finally, GG call. What a game, man. Game number seven will happen. Oh my god, really? Crazy, you know? Ay, ay, ay. How hold it? How, how he could survive? We're gonna check everything in military. 20 units kill more for Hera, which is incredible. Economy, that was the game, right? Because he got 5,000 more food, but 9k more gold. 9k more gold. I mean, Viper is... is feel fine with those games, you know? Probably we are more desperate than them. They are fine completely, and we are going to see, yes, game number seven. Game number seven that is gonna be, what map is going to be, guys? Well, King of the Desert, right? Arabia, Arabia, guys, Arabia. And what is gonna be the civilization? Well, it's going to be Mayans and Vietnam. My goodness. Let's keep going, guys, with the brutality. What a series, right? Uh, are you ready for game number seven? And now, guys, game number seven. The Viper has the Mayans. And you know what means the Mayans, right? Mayans are Mayans, guys. Let's go, Viper. Mayans are Mayans. Viper here. Okay. Game number seven. Let's go. Gain number seven. Gain number seven, Hera, Vietnam. The Viper with Mayans. Well, Vietnam is a fine civilization, but 
do we prefer here the Mayans or not, guys? This is crazy. The series were going 3-1. Now we are in a 3-3. But Hera has played crazy some of the games, really. What he can do now? Ooh, this is not a good lure by, by the Viper. Taking all the ships at the same time? Not good. Yeah, Ooh, wasting a lot of resources here. Okay. Thank you guys for joining. Welcome, everyone. Apologize for the subscriber chat, but since this is a... It's not live, it's recorded games, and sometimes people... This is sloppy and... Or not nice. We want to be safe and have the greatest possible experience. And, well, there's no problems anymore because we're in game seven. And it will be removed, the subscriber chat, very soon, amigos. And we can talk about the series, about the year, about everything. And you give me the feedback. If you have watched it also knowing the score, if you didn't and how you have enjoyed with the casting, even his recorded games. And honestly, I really don't know what to say anymore because I was thinking, well, let's get 1,000 viewers today and it will be great because it was streamed yesterday. 3.3K. <laughs> I want to cry, man. You are awesome, guys. Awesome. Amazing. Really. Berries at the back. Gold at the back. Look at those. Look at those hills, you know? Look at those hills that is kind of tricky. The gold. Well, actually, the Viper map. The wood is far. Eh, not that far. I don't know. But all this area is kind of. You have to wall something. Yeah. And the question here is Is he going to open. Scouts again? You know. Okay. I watched it live and still fun to rewatch with you, man. That's nice. I hope that this because my casting is on another level. Super quiet, right? <laughs> okay, let's see. We have three, five villages on wood. It's exploring now the snake, the Lambert camp. So he has to be careful about the, against the TC. All right. Well, uh, it's, I, I feel honor, you know, that people just watch it. Even if they watch it already yesterday, that's pretty sick. Pretty, pretty sick. That that you really love the game and, and, my, and my stream and my casting. That's... Well, one of the best compliments that you can give to a streamer. Thank you. Okay. Uh, easy to wall. He can see... No, he didn't explore this area. Obviously, he knows where his opponent is because Vietnam gives you the bonus. Three on goal. And Hera is going to scouts. Or he's going to go scams. No, no, no. I think he's going to go scouts. Double it has a horse collar without... Uh, cost any wood and then a scout in an archie range maybe as soon as he can I think so this is a unfortunate for sure oh he didn't even, even explore this wood line what the hell yeah scouts man crazy I mean it's not that it's bad absolutely not this village is lonely he could have tried to attack but he didn't okay Exploring all. The snake doesn't know what he's doing his opponent. Oh, well, the LOS from the Eagle is insane. But even like that, he didn't explore anything. He's doing one spear because he's going to see now this table. Very, very important that he explored that. I mean, for Hera, it's fine because he knows that he's going to go archer range. I mean, the question is, he's going to go militias or just directly to archers. But he has the answer right now. He didn't make the horse collar. Well, he did it. And now the archery range. Because with Vietnam, you can do that. Horse collar, double attack, then a stable and archery range. Lately, guys, the Meso Sifs are not getting huge results on Arabia. They are not getting huge results. So, let's see what's going to happen. But he's still walling. He's not attacking that one. He's exploring. I want to get together all the, sc the two scouts. Yeah, Spear. And for now, the Viper is defending. He can't really do much more at the moment. 
He has, what, two arches, one spear? He should send it forward, maybe? Nope, he's not doing. The spear is already there, and he's walling, but he only walled the left. Everything else is open. Now he's gonna wall more. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, and Vietnam has very good early bonus. You can see how he did. Archery range is stable. Already millions of farms, you know. And with horse color and, and double attacks. That's crazy. Well, his opponent can't, can't do it. And farms, look, four farmers, 11 farmers. 11 farmers, man. My goodness. Love you. Love this series. Love this game. Love everything and everyone, right? Let's go. Okay, he's attacking now. The archers, spears, and eagles. You have to be careful. Goal in the north. So many farms. 11 farmers, as I said, but he's here now. He's here in the woodland and didn't want anything. That villager is in danger, but he didn't lose it. Now the scouts are coming. Skirmish is out there. Fletching is going to kick in in a moment. He's going to take a villager down. One villager down. Okay. Got to be careful. He's already ahead. Oh, Viper 52 seconds idle TC. Terrible. Really bad. That's a lot of idle. I mean... Well, the macro is so important, and this is why you are trying to, to do a lot of army, doing many things, and control the units at the same time. Maybe the multitasking is not the greatest, and again, idle TC, that's behind already. He should be ahead two villages, and he's behind one. So, not good. Definitely not good. He's housing now Hera, which is... Oh, oh, we are talking about all this, and now he's housed forever. What the hell? Yeah, and now village number is the same. 30 villages, 30 villages for both. Look at the army numbers, plus one armor, while no upgrades for, for Hera. That's a problem. I'm getting closer, guys. I don't zoom out that much anymore. Hopefully, the experience is good as Observer. That's what I'm doing now. Yeah. And let's see the micro here. Plus one armor. Sick. Mining goal now. And with the plus one, now those skirmishes are in danger. As you can see, both with the same army, same population as well. Hera is just spamming military, same as the Viper. But those archers? Ooh. Okay. He's already using the market like crazy. No stone anymore. And now, those archers will be into the damn hell, probably. I mean, if he kills the scouts, he's fine. But he's not gonna happen. Skirmishes are there and no fletching. So, he has lost quite some army. And he did also plus one, plus one. Hera resources are looking amazing now. His micro is gonna take that scout, he can't. And those archers are in the hell. Yeah. I mean, he's gonna try to kill as much as possible HP, maybe even the, the scout, all right. No, no, no. And Hera resources are looking better, man. Wow. Awesome play with the Canadian with the micro, man. And, oh. But the market, man, crazy stuff. Yeah, need the goal. Both are going up at the same time. Pretty much. The Viper click. Hera click now. Hera has more army. He has also the 200 stone. Oh, no buildings. Oh, no, no, he has. He got a stable and archery rates, but he's doing now the blast, Oh, this is bad. This is bad for the Canadian. It's not letting him to make the, the fletching. So he need to come with the scouts, but the scouts are very low. What? Why you are living? If you don't let him make the blast with, it's huge. Actually, I don't, I don't understand why he move it now. And now, yeah, now you lose the archers for nothing. You stay here, man. Anyway, scout going away now, and he's gonna do eagles. He's still open. He did the market, stone, gold. Okay. But this area, another barrack, another Obama, three barracks. So he's going to go eagles. And Hera will do knights. We all know how how strong Hera is controlling the units, guys. Uh oh. No, you just killed the villager, man. What? He didn't. Anyway, it's called difference. The Canadian is scary. Really, really scary. 
Okay, got it. No, he didn't. He took that Valir. But he's doing eagles. The production is very slow. But he has three barracks. Eagle Warrior. The good thing is that he can produce in the main well. Nine scouts is gonna be light caps, man. Is gonna be light caps or not? No? No, he's doing knights. I mean, it's true that the light caps doesn't have like a big advantage with the eagles. Obviously, it's stronger than the scouts, but the eagle warriors dominate there. So you have to go probably knights. He's right. Boso, gold mine and upgrade. Now he's walling. Population Hera is still ahead. Look at the score. And now Squires forging Eagle Warrior. Let's see because this is important series, you know? It's like mentally for for the NAC5 Imagine. It's the same that Hera is winning 3-1 and Viper come back completely to a 3-4. Or that now with the last game Mayans, Hera is still 3-1. Being ahead down, he lose two and is still winning. I don't know if psychologic factor can matter between those two players, but you know, it can. Everything can matter. They are humans. Well, not not real humans, but you know what I mean. So let's see who is gonna take this last decided game. My goodness. Population is still here ahead. Not a lot more in the list. Yeah, it's only one more. But these eagles are dangerous, man. And at home? He has more eagles and monks. He's gonna go only one TC, probably, the snake. For a while. Knights, four, six knights, 13 eagles. It's plus one, plus one eagles. It's so many eagles right now. Uh oh. Might kill some villain here. He has to. Need to go back. Don't go to the TC. Yeah, this is dangerous. He's coming. Oh, but he's trying to come with more eagles at the same time. Let's see if he's going to be able to do the job. He needs to put all together. This is open. Probably not. He needs all the eagles together. He's 16 eagles. He's going to go to the wood line or not. Oh, oh, oh. It's open. It's open. It's open. It's open. Just now over chop. He over chopped right now with the eagles. Damn it. Okay, and now he has the monk as well. He needs to control the army, the snake, or Hera is gonna snowball with his crazy amount of knights and his micro. He converted, so important, the monks. Give me the monks. Okay, and he's coming now. 21 army, 21 army for both players. Okay, population getting almost the same. Advantage for Hera, two TCs, that's great. But probably now what, what Viper needs is just to keep going one tone center. Yeah, for a while. He has now 20 eagles. 20 eagles. Problem for Hera is that he can't counter-attack. Because if he counter-attack, he's kinda... He has nothing at home, Viper. Oh, but the monks are coming. He has a knight now, and if he convert with those two, the Viper might come back. The scores still say that Hera is ahead. Two knights already, the conversion is so important. The conversion is so important. He's walling, okay. But, but, plus two now, three knights already. Wow. Really, really wow. Those, those monks are without sanity. And ladies and gentlemen, Viper is coming back from the hell in this game and in this series. It seems so. 30 army, 17 army. A lot of, a lot of units right now for the snake. And I don't know how now Hera, even with his crazy micro, can counter this army. You know, it's going to be really difficult. He's also raiding here. That's the good thing. Viper at some point will have to add some more TCs. Is open this? No. Nope. And if he break it, it's not breaking it, man. It's just stone walls. Oh my lord. Okay. 31 army, 15. Here I keep holding, man. He's a beast. Both are based, right? 400 score difference. Okay. And now, where's the stone? He's gonna buy some stone or not? Not really. He's killing villages. He only got three. Now the goal. It's on the TC. The villages are on the town center. It's gonna take more and more or not. 70 population, 80 population. The scores still say that Hera is ahead, but I'm not sure. The key here, I don't know if you guys agree, is the monks. He's controlling the monks like God right now, Viper. Converting and keep them alive. So they heal the, the, the Aegis all the time. At home, he's there with some nice bat. He still have an army. Oh boy. 83 population, 76. Still Hera with 8 villages more. He deleted now the knight. The stable is gonna go to the damn hell. Oh man. 
plus two finally. And now he's going to convert the light cast. No, he's coming with more eagles. Ooh. Ooh. Where's Hera mining gold? And trying to find it. Ah, this is great. He didn't see it. Uh, the Viper. He didn't see the Viper that goal. Oh my god. That can be huge for the game. Population is still not too too far ahead now for the Viper. But military numbers is scary. It's still 10 villages behind. Okay. Yeah, the Mayans don't have redemption. The monks cannot convert the stables. Only Aztecs and Incas. And the Igas are coming. He's gonna try to take the TC. Huh? No, no, no. Uh oh. Okay, this is a lot of armies. Double the army. 90 military, 83. You gotta be careful. The Eagles. Mm? The population is so close. You don't want to lose the Eagles' advantage here. And I think he needs to find some more damage. But he's finding. He's finding in the south. But still, the TC is gonna be up. Now it's still attacking. Not the third TC. Uh oh. He's trying... No, man. Oh, my God. Population is very similar. How is he able to hold this, Hera? What the hell? He has only Fletching. That's a pity. If he had bot, he would be much better. His score is still ahead. 500. Three tone centers still. Okay. And the Viper is doing another barrel. He's going to keep going one TC. Yeah. He's going to keep going one tone center probably the whole game. Yeah. 15 villages are idle. So, right now... He's ahead in economy because the, the, the villains are just not working. The question is, who goes siege now or, or just eagles and keep raiding? The TC is still alive and the knights, nine knights, 12 light caps. He need to find this. Need to kill something. Harson. That helps against the buildings, guys. That's the upgrade for the buildings. Goal and Lambercam, Margol, a stone that is not taken and now he's going around. Oh, man. But at the end, guys, how is possible that Hera has lost four villages in all this? Four villages in all this. The TC is now going down a lot faster. You got to be careful. He's going to lose now some monks, as you can see. This battle can be the game. But let's see. No, no, no. He's going back. He's going to take it. Oh, the monks. And now he's going to... Oh, okay, but he lost a couple of monks. The TC is not down. He needs to kill something. If he's not killing Viper, he will fall behind and behind and behind in the economy. But look at Hera, the Canadian, holding with his super crazy macro, micro and the multitasking, the APM population, 102, 93. He's going to take everything or not. Ay, 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 ay. Well, the Eagles are there with the plus two, plus two. He's killing everything or not. 33 army, 17. He's trying to kill the knight and the village is still going with the with the eagles and ladies and gentlemen the viper is killing everything now 25 army he takes so many villages that this is going to be down the score still say that Hera is ahead but now he's not ahead anymore i believe yeah he took 12 villages now in total and only five villages behind the snake it's coming back from the hell that only brings more and more hype for nag 5 because you know that Hera always play 100%. Obviously, it's not the same in the super big tournaments, but he always play 100% in the ladder as well. And well, we can see how the level is so, so close between those two, you know? And anything can happen. Anything can happen. Let's see. Because Hera is not going to give up. I mean, the score still say that he's ahead. And he's ahead in Villains, but not in Army. Is Viper gonna do more barracks? No more tone centers. Oh my god. He's still spamming. Just look. 10 eagles on the queue. While Hera is doing a trade card. Okay. A trade card is solid. Yeah. Not needed, but it's solid. Anyway. Uh... <laughs> okay. Look at those eagles. Oh, the production for, for Hera. Now the knights. Okay. You gotta be careful. 90 population, 98. It's crazy that he's still in this game. It's crazy that he still have 35 farmers, 28 on goal. And he's still doing knights, man. What the hell? How is it even possible? Look at the farming he has. He moved. I think Viper is doing one mistake. The mistake Viper is doing is not exploring anything all over the map. To rate. He's attacking all the time in this area. While he could send... Two, three eagles all over, you know, at the bottom, in the north. Yeah, and also he's doing another mistake. With the monks that he has all the time, 
he could have taken already the five relics. That with this approach on one tone center, it will help a lot. Like really, really a lot. You know, really, really a lot. Now he has 14 knights, 44 eagles. 44 eagle warriors, which is crazy. Let's see now the knights. He's gonna go or not? Yeah, it's plus two, plus two. And those knights are plus one, plus one. He's gonna go? No. Now he's gonna find it. Oh, now he see the gold miners. Well, he see the gold. And now he, this is crucial. This is really, really crucial, you know? Really crucial. But now let's see the battle here with so many eagles. The knights are coming, the monks as well. He see it and he need to go away with those. That's the problem. Now he's raiding in several spots at the same time. I say it and he's doing. Memstradamus, guys. But it's true, man. You need to raid. Only missing the relics. Now more barracks. And seriously. If Hera come back in this game, I don't know what to say. The Viper is just spamming like crazy. One TC completely. You know. Full. One TC aggression. With the Meso Sif. He's still raiding constantly. You can be so, so fast like Hera it is. A man is almost just impossible. I think we can disable now the subscriber chat mode. Nobody's gonna spoil and I want to see the hype when this game is gonna finish. So where's my mod? You can disable and let all the plebs speak in the channel. Come on. Okay, let's see the Eagles now. And GG has been called. What the hell was that? My goodness. Unbelievable, man. Unbelievable. Seriously. Unbelievable. Unbelievable games and unbelievable series. Oh, my goodness. Incredible. Honestly, I don't know how many of you knew about this. I didn't know what's happening in the series. When I saw 3 1, I was like, okay, again, again, uh, a, a destruction. But it wasn't. And he came back. Honestly, it's the first time that. I think I, I remember that the Viper in a Meso game, it's only go one TC. You know, I don't know if you recall correct, but I think it's the, 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 the way to play. He could do a little bit better with the relics, you know, and maybe if Hera sent a few light caps because he, he never sent it also, it would be terrible for the snake, which he didn't. Oh, no, I but overall, arrived. crazy series, guys. Crazy, crazy series, you know, crazy, crazy series. And well, if you guys have enjoyed, people on YouTube watching this, subscribe, thumb up, leave a commentary. It helps really, really a lot. My goodness.